You looked at me first. I'm like, I looked at you that. first because you you personally like to come from. Shit. I don't like that phrase. Come for me? You know, Unless you, it's being you. you like Sounds it. a little pornish, huh? Yeah. Stop. I got you. I got you. I got you. Oh, we laugh. Oh. <laughs> yeah, that motherfucker just popped up on my phone. <laughs> Microphone. Damn. Damn. You know what I'm saying? Nah, but man, hey. We back. Damn. Hold on, man. Hey, y'all know, you know they said we couldn't do it, man. They, they, no, they, they said, said we, we couldn't do it. it they said we couldn't do what? They said we couldn't do it, baby. They said we couldn't be the number one podcast in motherfucking KC. But listen, come on, man. These niggas ain't fucking with me on this motherfucking mic. Come on. Dad I told you the first episode. What are you talking? What you tell me? I told I you, bro. Ain't nobody giving it up how we give it up. You know what I'm saying? Talk to these niggas. And please. that was the first episode. First episode. What, what episode we on now, baby? Come on. Bro, we were on like 13. 12? 12? We're on 12. Shit. Is it 12? It's like 14. Oh boy! It's up there, homies. Look, y'all, but they not, they not messing with us, bro. That shit's stuck they on my soul. You think I'm saying that shit's stuck? Oh so, nah, man. We gotta get. So listen, we gotta get these motherfucking introductions. We gonna start over there to the far right and work our way over. His high coming down. Yeah, that nigga over there. So y'all gotta, own so y'all gotta bear with him. Uh, He's in the twilight zone right now. I gotta bear with him. But nah, Montel Bear, what's up, fool? Living life, living life, living life. You yeah, said what? Living, living, living life, living life, living life. I can dig it. I can dig it. Fuck, Quay, yes. you over the Kiki Kiki on my knees, man. You know it's cold outside. Uh, <laughs> yeah, there was somebody <laughs> out. I'm Kiki just saying it's cold outside, man. Inside I couldn't put the knees out. <laughs> I couldn't have them out, man. It's cold outside, man. But Quay, what's up with you, man? I'm dead. Um, I'm cool. I'm good. I'm. I got here a little late, but you know, it's cracking. Shit happens. I was here at 29, so I was actually on time. If you think about it. We'll bike, I mean, we gonna bike people time or whatever. Anyway, <laughs> Devo, Devo, money in this motherfucker. Y'all, no, if y'all know, y'all know. No quarantine. Look, yeah, if y'all, if no, y'all know, he's y'all not know. moving different. No, I'm not under no quarantine. You do what I'm saying. I'm it still out every is. day. Facts. You do what I'm saying, and I'm not sick either. You nope. do what I'm saying. I'm, I'm chilling, man. I'm chilling. And chillin'. you got a haircut. Baby. Back right in the you shouldn't ever even remind me. <laughs> show them the ways, man. Show them how you swimming. <laughs> you fucking nuts, man. You know who the fuck I am. I ain't about to... hey, nigga, come on. You know who the fuck I am. If you don't know by now, man, you ain't gonna never fucking know. Brie, what's up, man? What's oh, up? Yeah. Hey, y'all. <laughs> yeah, it's a white team. What's up? Nothing much, y'all. Stuff. You know, just living my best life. Living your Period. best life. What's I'm that living like? Living my best life. Being happy. <laughs> Being happy. What's that include? What is, what is your definition of happiness? Self-love. Ooh, nigga. Self-love. All right, Gandhi. Cool beans. Definitely could... Um, I'm Gandhi's daughter. I can underdig that. that what? Self happiness or self love? Self love. You niggas don't love yourselves. <laughs> Boy, please, I'm fine. <laughs> I ain't even gonna say what I want to say, man. But loving yourself is. More I know what you're about to say. Don't don't, don't be that. Don't about, don't be that guy. Not less about how you look, or but more so about how you feel about yourself. Mm-hmm. Like yeah, we I'm, all know that you all everybody can say that they look good. So how y'all mental health? How y'all about. feeling? Mental health, boy, I'm lit. Damn. I could probably. You know, I, I told myself. Go ahead, bro. I literally just had this conversation with uh Koi earlier. I had to take like a few days away from social media to kind of mm. get my mind right. So I'm per- like I'm I feel good. Like I feel real good. Martel, Koi, how y'all mental health? I mean, I'll- I need to get hot. Swear to God, bro. Straight out, I felt that. I swear to God, I've been getting hot every single day. And, but that's like, how you're supposed to do it, though. Supposed to live your life. That's, that's, that's what they dog say. It's, it's gotten worse. Smoke weed every day. You said like, we well, getting more what? I used to. I used to be able to like. I gotta. I gotta face a whole blunt to get high because I've been smoking so much. That's sad. That's good shit. But that's that's as long as ain't virgins no more. That's good shit. <laughs> well, they never was. I just you know went on and off with the shit. But now I'm just like, what else is there to do? So. Right. <laughs> <laughs> nah, I like how y'all was in the so, uh, with the lip smack. <laughs> Ooh, Let's get into no, some of these comments, fine. boy. Boy, you got some horse. I'm not, not, I can't say horse. Some horse. horse. Some waitress in, in the comments, my nigga. Damn. Ron Shay Walker said, D Lo Money, no, he's fine. Thanks, baby. Hey, fam. What's up, Latoya, bro? What's going on with you? Bree Jackson, I see you, girl. The knees is put up. I just told you, niggas, man. They not coming out till next week, man. Y'all gonna wait y'all turn, man. I know these motherfuckers are luscious, but shit. I'm <laughs> weak as fuck. Boy, <laughs> nigga, the light was hitting off them. You see how it was reflecting, my nigga? Well, I must have went back and watched that episode the next morning, boy. Weak as fuck. <laughs> fuck, oh god, that motherfucker. Fuck all you funny. niggas. You dig what I'm saying? I make that shit from the bottom. Well, we of was heart. not letting your knees breathe <laughs> no whatsoever, man. Fuck we you. We still niggas. ain't letting them breathe. <laughs> they really. <laughs> <laughs> man, bro, it was not a crack of ash in nowhere in sight. <laughs> in your knees. So you niggas want me to be ashy? Like, what? 
<laughs> like, what we talking about here? Like, nah, you ain't gotta be ash with damn. Your mirror, <laughs> your fucking knees ain't gotta be mirrors either. Bro. My nigga, like, listen, my shit got a shine. I can't get. Wow. Oh, it ain't making no better. Had an ankle sock suit. That's kind of the fucking yeah, part. Yeah, bro. And all I wear is ankle socks. Gym teacher legs. Yeah, <laughs> baby. <laughs> Easy, easy, beautiful legs. <laughs> Get your she shit off, man. Get your shit off, man. She ain't shit. She ain't shit. We gonna let your knees breathe. Yeah, we we have 21 views right now, so all Damn, 21 homies. of y'all need like, to go ahead comment. and share this mug right now. Man, like, also, share, make comment, sure y'all man. tap in for doing? Brick House. Definitely second. make sure y'all tap in for Brick House. Facts, me. That was some bullshit last week, but it was a good It was a good. I mean, not last week. Two, about two weeks, two weeks ago, ago, was it? Two weeks ago, was y'all was on ago. bullshit. Then nobody it was pretty good. It was on good BS. But you know what? But we need a break from y'all last week. Y'all still yes. get, y'all still did a good job. If you said break from all last week bullshit. Uh, yeah. What happened last? Oh. <laughs> that, yeah, that. You said this shit. Yeah. That was fuck with your brain, yeah, boy. Exactly. Yeah, it, was, it really was messing with my brain because because she was some... thinking like, huh? So do, like, shit, the shit be fucking with do, my do brain. Do y'all want to talk about that real quick or do we? No, we'll talk about that later. We'll talk about that later. I'm like, all the funny buttons. Go ahead, slide in first. Take the weekly then. Come on, slide in first. Who going first, bro? Oh shit. I really want my tail to go first. His, his is like. <laughs> matter of fact, we we gonna come back to you because you a little. I wanna be yeah, you over there. You over there, fucked up in the corner, Cass. Yeah, my boy, my get boy your mental together real quick, man. Um, love you too, Tommy. D Lo, go ahead, man. So, we'll let you go first. Hi, Tommy. Shit. Yours the most inter- interesting news of the day. Go ahead. It's it's more um recent. I wanted to talk about the whole six nine situation. You know what I'm saying? First off, um, <laughs> teriyaki six nine. Teriyaki. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, okay, well, he, we all knew he was getting out of jail sooner or later because he was just, he was singing Correct. like Patti LaBelle in that everybody. motherfucker. So we knew he was getting out sooner or later. But I was seeing, I've been seeing people like on Facebook like what defending him. You know what I'm saying? Like, as far as what? Saying like, <laughs> but basically just trying to make it seem like what he did was okay. Was they making it seem like it was okay or was they. Yeah, basically making it seem like what he did was okay. And my thing, like my thing, yeah, and snitching is not okay if you run around He's telling people to test it. your gangster. Yeah. If you telling people to test your gangster, then it's not okay for you, you to snitch. It's, co- it's considered snitching once you're did y'all involved see the video we put in out? that act. Yeah, I've seen that shit. If you out there doing the same L- shit listen. with them. You can't go tell listen, on them. Listen, I'm, not so saying that, I'm, not, I'm not saying that I respect what he did. I'm not, I'm not saying I respect snitching at all. That's not what I'm saying. But yeah. I'm saying what I video understood you what the about? fuck he's talking about. He was basically saying in the video that he was saying, like, nigga, y'all fuck my baby mama. Okay. Yeah. Y'all I'm glad you said that. The, hold on, let me finish. About to kidnap my, uh, my mama. His mama. About to kidnap me. Kill me. It's some more shit. So who really supposed to, like, hold loyalty down? Listen, listen. From that point, I kind of understood it, but I'm not respecting it. Listen, listen. Go ahead. As a street nigga, bro. You gotta get your lick back. Kick the ballistics real quick. You gotta get your um, lick back. This Talk hashtag the free game. So make sure y'all, y'all, y'all got hashtag free. Oh, I like that hashtag, hashtag free game. Free game. So, <laughs> um, I'm going back in. Okay, look. Let me <laughs> let me kick the ballistics Shut the real fuck quick. Up. Go ahead. Talk your shit. When you a street nigga, right? You supposed to. For one, you never take that stand, bro. You don't At ever all. get on that stand. Period, bro. You don't ever. You don't snitch on nobody. When you a street nigga, when you telling everybody to suck your dick suck right. and test your gangster. And then some niggas come test your gangster. They come kidnap you and rob you. And you hear about them plotting on to kill you and everything. And you do not a damn thing. Except go in the breakfast club talking about, oh, yeah, I fired my whole crew in this and third. Talking all this shit. But you ain't you ain't seen about nothing. Mm-hmm. Me personally, if I got kidnapped, I'm I'm not. I'm I'm we gonna see about that shit. I'm not gonna wait for everybody you gotta to get, get your lick back. Up. You have to get your lick back, bro. So basically, like, I, I can't for stretch an that some shit Bible up. type shit. You said what? An eye for an eye on some Bible type shit. Yes. It when you Look, it's six nine. If it was like, like Lil Nas, if that shit happened to him and he snitched, whole different ball game. Different ball game. He don't mm-hmm. rap about. He don't. He don't put money on niggas' heads and all of this extra shit. Sure That's we'll what six that. nine was doing. Okay. So when you do that shit, you don't. You you can't snitch. You don't. You don't have this. It's not an option. It's not yeah, an option. Right, now, like I, say, I don't disagree. now, I do not now disagree. if the weekend was to get beat up and robbed and everything, and he went and snitched on them niggas, we you know. He not, the weekend's not a street nigga. He's not putting money on niggas' heads. He's not telling oh, everybody. Oh, no, talking some tough shit. He's raps. He's telling he he niggas for his Jordans <laughs> to buy some cocaine okay, for bitches. Okay, okay, you're, right, you're, right, right, you're right. You're right. You're right. Oh, you, you show right. I don't even know. What, let me just somebody else. Y- y'all know what I'm trying to say. Kanye. Right? You mean Kanye? Usher. Usher. You Usher. could. Usher. You. I nah, like herpes. You could nah, he got herpes. Has Kanye ever claimed to be a street nigga? I ain't never heard Kanye talk about no slide, no no song. Yeah, so I could see. Kanye. So it's like when you say when you when you live in that when you live in that life and you own that shit and you portraying that persona, snitching ain't an option. When they kidnap Kanye you, was you're supposed to see about that shit. You said Kanye was knocking people out. Who, who was Kanye? Kanye went Dame Dash. 
Yes, he was. Y'all see them Shit. videos on TMZ when he was hitting people in their face. He will mock them. <laughs> Mika Maka. Talk- Mika Luka. You can look man. it up. It's the truth. Oh. I believe it. I mean, I believe what? it. They was running oh, up shit. and he cracked them. Period. Look it I up. I believe it because Kanye ain't never been no bitch. So, so did y'all hear the 6 9 song? Yes. No. Ass. It, it, yes, it was. What y'all think? Talk to me. What y'all, honestly, what y'all think? Me either. The shit was ass. It. it was ass, bro. It was, I still want to hear it. I mean, right. Do y'all really want... No. I, he just don't. was like, I don't want to. I don't no. want to give him that view. I don't want to give him that view. I do. Y'all played Drake no. stuff last time. Drake, Drake ain't snitched on nobody. Yeah, yeah we don't come up. Drake, all he do is talk bad to his bitches. <laughs> he don't <laughs> talk bad to bitches. Drake's a ham. Low. Drake, he a the yeah, he is, oh, yeah. and he talks bad to every. He, he could be a ham when he want to be, but but Drake really is. He'll get on your ass. Sixty million away. Don't provoke that nigga. I know his music. Like I know this nigga is not talking about me. He's a quiet. He's a quiet storm. Silent but deadly. That nigga be talking he, shit. He keeps his Have you ever heard he minds his business to you tap into his line and then he gotta yeah. show you what he's about. Except push your T though. Push your T kinda Push your T. Yeah. Push your T out of all I'm people where that nigga fuck out. All people. I'm not a fan Fucking of Push your T. I really nigga, feel, I really feel like his I really feel like his diss was ass, but maybe that's just my opinion. But y'all can feel how y'all feel. Y'all crazy as hell. Push your T got some shit. Push your T hard. But, but push your T hard as fuck. It's just that it's just like Y'all crazy as hell. Y'all sleep on Drake ass. Y'all sleep on Drake ass. I think Drake was Afraid that he might have done something to him, bro. Y'all sleep Fuck on nah. Pusha T's pen no. like that ass. Drake is uh, Drake. Drake, bro, Drake, Drake ain't getting close that, to that man. Pusha T got him. Yeah, that. he did. He did. He did. He, he told. Him. Him. Yeah, he said. Yeah, I'm skipping. He, he said it. He was like, oh yeah, yeah. He got he me. Said, like, that's that's the for sure. L he took. He no. was he was sitting. He was I he was sitting in that interview looking sad as fuck. Um, explaining that shit. What he said. That that um that interview when he was sitting there with LeBron. I thought you were talking about nah, not at the uh, shop. Okay. Uh, radio, not, not at the shop. Uh, Y'all have to show me that video. The video we talking about of him he saying he took the hell. Yeah, it's a, it's it's, it's a, an interview. Though. I'm not just talking about. Uh, uh, he, was, he was getting interviewed by a white woman. I want to say. So what what, okay, and this, is there in any circumstances uh, snitching okay? Yeah. Give me but the if you. So how is this, okay, give me an example. I'm asking this question. If you if you if you if you're not living that, if you're not living that life, if you're a regular pedestrian and something happened to you and you tell the police who did it and what, that's I mean, bro, that's that's okay. If something happened to Bree and she told the police, I wouldn't look at her no type of way because she don't she don't partake in none of that type of shit. Mm-hmm. Does it but have it, to be somebody? Does it have to be done to you, or can it be like say somebody did some shit to my cousin? And I'm like, and I seen exactly it, what happened. I if, know who did it, and I tell them. It it depends because if you if you a, if you a, a street nigga for lack of a better word, uh-huh. you never you let the police do their job. You mm-hmm. you never tell them n- nothing. You don't tell them anything. Anything happen to any of y'all? I'm snitching. Period. Okay. I got right. I can understand. Now me personally, me personally, I've never been a street nigga. But me personally, if something happened to any one of y'all, we're going to see about it. We're not, we not going to the police. We're we going to hold court. Well, me I'm a Christian, so I'm yeah, I can't. I, I can't. <laughs> Bitch, I got the 38, bitch. No, you don't. Give me that oh, shit. <laughs> Hit you in the head with your own gun. Uh, it, who, wants to, uh, who wants to go <laughs> next? They, they really in the comments trying to use my slang, bro. They talking about in there, man. Call cheeseburger. They call each other hamburgers and cheeseburgers. And shit. <laughs> <laughs> well, I'm seeing yeah, cheeseburger yeah. emojis and shit. Oh. Cheeseburger and no pickles. Oh. Hey, man. Speaking of which, guys, I need you guys to leave, I need you guys to leave a cheeseburger dead, emoji huh? in the comments. If y'all watching this shit, and like, share, comment. We yes. BLE Studios is Popular yeah. Ignorance episode 13, 14? Thir- 13? I'm not really sure, but we in this motherfucker. You dig exactly. what I'm saying? Motherfucker at, this point, at this point, y'all know the deal. You do what I'm saying? Dig, we never one Friday, podcast man. in the town. You do what I'm saying? Talk to him. Her. There will Talk never be. There will never Make be sure. another PI, bro. Make you know sure y'all follow our follow our other socials because we don't just have Facebook. We have Instagram. We also have Twitter. Yeah, All y'all of can reach the us same too. Yeah. At Popular Ignorance. Make sure y'all follow those because you get the views up on there. Where's my so so. so who wants to go next? My 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 ignorant weekly, yo. I feel like it's a bucket of bullshit, no, I'm and I guess I'm ready. I'm so excited. More of the more of the story is if you talking that gangster shit snitching is it's, it's never an option. Yeah, it's Baby never an option. Facts. If you're a part of that life, be a part it's of that natu- life. It's never an option. You let them people do their job. But go ahead. It's a lot of you ratatouille ass niggas out here at the time, but we're not gonna talk about that shit. I don't think that's your G14 classified, but y'all here. You know who you are. Yeah, yeah. You yeah, walk the streets know, like you know them, but we, we know see who you niggas nigga. are, bro. Damn. Yeah, um, but uh, so anybody want to go next with the next thing weekly? Okay, go ahead. How do y'all feel about double standards? As far as what? Just in general, it, it gotta happen. Life is full of yeah, yeah, yeah. That's what it I gotta was happen. Say. You it know, gotta happen. It's just certain th- certain double standards. You we ha- we have to live. I with. think double standards are exact are exactly what keep us equal. As far because, as because because we because the more. 
the way that the world is going, we're trying to remove double standards. And that is the problem. If double standards are placed in our lives in order to keep everybody in check, mm -hmm. men can do certain things that women can't. It sucks. Yes, you want to do those things. Yes, but you're still going to be looked at for those things because society still rules by double standards. You can't think about what you just want to do. You have to think about how society is going to look at you because of these double standards already set. Those mm -hmm. standards are never going to change no matter how how uh, far we thin the line out. We're, it's still going to be double standards. And I feel like it's what keeps us equal. And the more we fight the more that we fight against the double standards, the harder it's going to be for us to come together. So do you think feminists are wrong? Huh? So do you think feminists are wrong? Um, no, not all them. Not all double standards need to, because well, most most feminists aren't fighting against the double standards. They're fighting for equality everywhere. So it's not just in 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 talking to somebody. It's in corporate workplaces is also in um feeling comfortable when you go out now that'll roll us into one of our other topics being more comfortable when you go out or being able to be a woman in a male dominated area so it's more so getting women introduced to areas that we haven't been but not changing what you are as a woman if that makes sense so do you feel as if women should get paid the same exact money in every job in every field anybody who works the same anybody who works the same amount as you should get the, the same amount of pay as you. So we, both, so we both work at a warehouse, right? Right. And I do more, I put more boxes up per hour than you put up per hour. Should I get I paid the get, same amount of money? Same amount of money as you? No, you, I should get, you should get paid more. I mean, of course it depends on what job that you're doing. I'm saying, but I'm like, a man, you're a woman, so I feel like it's kind of a double standard. You dig what I'm saying? Like, but physically, you're you're physically, gonna you're I'm gonna be able to. That's my you're point. gonna yeah, you're gonna be able to uh, produce more just because that's what I'm talking you got about. More job, more I feel like it's different though. Like, but that's can't. not what I'm saying. I'm saying for this position, warehouse worker, they pay eighteen dollars an hour. Warehouse mm -hmm. worker, you should get paid eighteen dollars an hour. It shouldn't defer whether you're a man or a woman. Right. Maybe it should defer about the amount of work you're able to do because a woman may be able to come in and put fifteen more boxes up than you can. So it shouldn't be about right. your sex. It should be solely about what the, what you're able to produce. So it 50 50 on bills is cool too. 50 50 on 50 50 on bills is cool to an extent, but then, then again, so? but then what? again, it comes back to that double standard because there are women who want to live the wife lifestyle and men who want to be the or live the generic wife style, and there mm. are men who want to allow women to live the generic wife lifestyle. So you have those men and those women who marry each other who know that the men are going to take care of the take care of the bills, and the woman's going to take care of the household. There are people, uh, relationships that work exactly like that. And that whole relationship is full of double standards. But I feel like we can't be picky with equality, though. I kind of feel like that's kind of boozy as fuck to say, because I just seen a comment Damn, that said, that, like, that shit, bro, I just kind of seen, yeah. seen a comment that said, that, like, y'all want equality till y'all get it. And then it's like, y'all saying, enough, you know wait, we all don't want equality. We get, but, some of us want equality. But you know that's what I'm saying. What I'm saying. It's, it's, it's making it available for you to be able to, not withholding it from you because you are. I'm not going to tell you you can't go somewhere because you're black. And say I was white and we was walking in a theater and I said, you can't go in here because you're black. That's unfair to say to you just because you're black. But that's more or less human decency, though. Like, I'm, I'm, no, as a human, not. I should it's, be able to just walk into this motherfucker because I'm a human. And as a woman, I should be able to get paid as much as you if I'm doing just But not if you're work. not doing the same same exact labor. If you're not doing the same, if you're doing the same exact work, but I'm doing it at a higher rate than you. But that's what I'm saying. Why should I get paid the same I'm, exact exactly. as you. We're, we're sh we should base it on the work, not the fact that I'm a woman. The fact that I'm a woman doesn't mean that you're going to pr produce more work than me. How often does that happen? What do you mean? How often, like in a warehouse, does it happen? The woman warehouse. Produces... We're talking about warehouse. What, what about in a company, in a in a Fortune 500 company? Then we got yeah. women running, running it, then. but she's getting paid less than her male counterpart because she's a woman. That's what I'm saying. It should, like, that type of, when we ask for equality, it's that make it available to the women who want to. Don't make it available. Don't say, oh, just just because they want it, y'all all gotta want it. That's not fair. Because that's what? like, how's that? That's fair? like some niggas. That's like some black people saying, oh no, we was cool with being with Massa. Everything was good. Then other black people saying, oh yeah, we all want freedom. But them other black people saying, but oh yeah, who, we cool with Massa. Uh, yeah, you're cool with Massa. But if Massa <laughs> say you can go home, you can go. Is are you gonna be like, okay, I'm gonna keep working this field? No. Make that's it exactly available. what they was again, doing. Again, like I said, make it available to the Lost. people. Make it available to the people who want it and the people who don't want it. Don't don't force them into it. So if uh, everybody wants to oh, be able okay. to get into a party, everybody can get in the party, mm. but everybody doesn't have to go to the party is what I'm saying. Mm. 
double standards, but the double standards are what keep us in in boundary to keep certain people in certain places. Which double standards do you feel keep us in keep us um, equal? Like, what I would double say, standards exactly do you feel keep us equal? Because because that right there, there's nothing equal about the scenario that you two were just debating about. There's, there's nothing equal about that. You know, so no matter how you slice it, um, which I was just talking about, any of those scenarios. It's not it's not equal no matter how you look at it because it's still like y'all still basing it off of sex or something like not not y'all but just saying like the scenario. So I'm saying what um which double standards specifically do you think keep us all equal? I think double standards when it comes to um when it because well when it comes to like how many men or how many women or how many men, how many men a, a woman has slept with like a woman a man can judge a woman can judge a woman based off that but not a man because men were not have not been taught to not have sex with a lot of people but women were mm -hmm. so it's like that's double standard i kind of that's kind of nature though i feel like in a way though like that's it's not nature. on a it's, primal it's, level it's not nature that's no, definitely that's a double talk. standard i feel like that's on a more, I'm more I feel like that's on a primal level, though. I don't feel like that's more on a. Well, right women or wrong thing. being judged based off of how many sexual partners they have is. I'm not saying it's okay. I'm saying it's more so okay than a man being judged because of the way we were taught. Mm -hmm. So I think when you are, I'm not saying you can't have sex with people. If you want to go out there, you, you want to have just sex. Using that's it as fine. an example. That's yeah. what I'm saying. Everybody yeah. can do it. Allow everybody to do it. But don't force everybody into it. It's so like, I, that's that's the whole point I'm trying to do. Yeah. If women want to have sex with whoever they want to have sex with, cool, that's fine. Yeah, right. But don't force all when women y'all should all go be hoes. Because some of them, some of us still should have standards for the men who look for women that have standards. Because not all men want sluts. Some niggas want sluts. Some niggas don't. <laughs> He's a whore. If you a so. slut, you can come my way. <laughs> He's a yeah. whore. All the sluts. You just can't All be the broke. I mean, my no, my, no broke sluts. Anybody else want to go to the Ignite Weekly? My Ignite Weekly is like double. It's double standard. I'm oh, God. Is it? <laughs> Have you heard about Earl Thomas and his wife? What happened? Basically, Earl Thomas was like glazing like a group of bitches. You dig know what I'm saying? Well, <laughs> not, probably not a group of bitches uh, or a heap of bitches, but. Mm -hmm. Probably like two bitches at one time. You dig know what I'm saying? Baby mama. Shit, that's, well, that's, that's got to with the baby he mama. What, he was with it. Well, what the story, ha what happened was he was with his brother and they got into an argument. With about, the baby mama? About, yeah, what is, uh, no, it was his wife. Same difference. Yeah. yeah tomato. And it was over, I think it was over a bill. It was over a bill or something. And, he, and his brother came and got him. And so she, snapped, she logged into his Snapchat. And fit, seen a whole bunch of pictures and videos of him with females. Wait, he was yes. arguing with his wife about a bill? And his brother yeah. came and got him? Oh, okay. okay. Yeah. Like, it was a heated argument. So, they <laughs> left. And she seen the whole... She went... She logged into his Snapchat. Went in there. Seen a whole bunch of pictures and videos of other females. Mm -hmm. So, mm. she tracked mm -hmm. his phone. Just moving sloppy. Yeah. His so fuck. She tracked his location. <laughs> she tracked his location to a rented Airbnb. And then <laughs> she got there. She got there. And both him and his brother was in the bed. With two females. Uh -huh. oh, <laughs> Don't do that. Don't do that. Don't do that. Oh, you a bitch. I will beat my nigga. And she pulled a she pulled a gun out and she told the officers that uh, it didn't have the chamber in there, like it didn't have the clip in there. But then they found out uh, she lied and it actually had uh, one one round in the chamber. Oh yeah, she was ready to. Blow I, I feel like she was wrong, yeah. honestly. She pissed her with him. Because I feel like she going to stay with this nigga. So what's the point of, like, if you going to stay with this if nigga. If you going to stay with him, then yeah, you might as well just shut Wait, the fuck what, up. Exactly. True. But Let I this mean, nigga cheat in peace. For real. But in that, in that moment, when she, when she was tracking him, she, she was angry. So it but goes, you don't go know them bitches from Adam. You dig what I'm saying? What, she beat the bitches up too? Yeah. She oh, the, okay. See she, that. Put, she upped the 40 yeah. on both of them. Hey, she everybody shot, she shot. She <laughs> shot one of the girls' phone. See, I, I specifically would have beat my nigga up. I would have beat the shit out of my nigga. That I understand. He would know what's going he on. He knows better. You know that. Know what's going and on. if I decide to stay with you afterwards, it, it's different with celebrities and shit because they shit immediately goes out. So if I catch my nigga with another bitch and I beat my nigga up and I go back, but nobody knows about it, that's, that's just our football player. That's so our he business. He's paying all the bills. He's paying everything. Mm -hmm. Car notes, her taxes, his taxes, everything. So like, Do you think a man paying all the bills gives him the right to cheat? Yep, but not if you rich though. If you rich, I think because it you, comes if, with the territory. If you, if you, you know, rich, I, I really, then it's like I really think it depends on a female. 
I know if I'm rich, because y'all know how I feel about y'all. Like, y'all already know how I feel about all this type of shit. Uh-huh. But if I'm rich, then it's like it's different. But I'm, 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 I'm getting money now. But like, I'm, right. I'm, I'm, it's petty change. Up, this damn yeah, money yeah, like, yeah, that's nothing. Like, this we, is shit we I would live. be paying for anyway. You're just here. Yeah, exactly. Like, but, but when we like trying to make ends meet and shit, yeah, yeah. you better pull some type of weight. Or therefore, don't ask me where my meat be. Damn homies. So, you agree your money that? equates to sex. Low key, we ask that is a fucking, money, that's a gem right there, what you just said. It doesn't equate that's to My not, time, not, my money, it's not even that's about, my pussy. It's not even about that. <laughs> that's my, that's my, I value that. You dig know what I'm saying? How you value your vagina? Mm-hmm. I value my time, my money, my, my loyalty. I value all those things. <laughs> the women take that shit for granted. You dig know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. Like, bitch, if I come over your house and get you, it, smoke a, a, a Little three five with you, dig what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. Order you a pizza? Yeah, I would like some cheeks. I, 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 I would. <laughs> but I if would. she says no, I'm not gonna press you for the pussy, but bitch, she's she no she not obligated. This ain't no playhouse. She's not obligated. At this point, stay at home. But I make me. But you get sandwich. my point, though. I just feel like right. So I, yeah, you gonna, okay. those are you gonna, you gonna want some cheeks, but I mean, she not she not obligated. But so it's okay for y'all to do those things. The sex after y'all spend the money, but it's not okay for her to want the money before y'all have the sex. Don't look Nobody at me. Never I ain't say that. No, 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 no. Niggas say they pussy all the time. I ain't say that. No, niggas say they pussy all the time. But bitches want the money before they get the before they have the sex. I feel like a lot of times we're looking at them but like. You, but you know what though? You is on the side. Yeah, right? so it's cool to see the money though. when you want the pussy. But you, you when we want the money before we want the dick. Hold on, wait. That's not even she owns the dick. She owns something, but it's more or less like I gotta give her that. I gotta check your whole fact. I gotta check the background. Right. Let me see how good the pussy is, and let me see what you, how you slobbed. I need to see all these things. You dig what I'm saying? And Before I get get this, because if I give up money for a she bad corn, see a bank roll. But I'm saying she could suck, up, she could suck the meat off your dick and and ride that motherfucker into the sunset. She suck a nigga so. And, and you know that's for a fact because y'all brought that. <laughs> Why do you reach out a point when he said the shit? <laughs> I have to see what you do before I get burned off these twenties. What are you talking and she about? She gotta see what you got in your pocket before she. If gets I break out, okay, that's that's that's, that's, that's fair. That's fair. That's, 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 that's fair. fair. I, that's I can't fair. even talk <laughs> shit. <laughs> as much as I want to talk shit, I can't. That's fair. Though. I can't, I've it. bro. I've stumped them. To... <laughs> I've <I'm laughs> done, done it. You said what, Bree? I'm gonna have to disagree. As far as what? All that sound goofy as fuck. Elaborate. I feel like that's fair. A little know. pussy for some for some money. A little pussy. I mean, we all have a pussy in a way, kinda. You know I mean, what if you want fucking free, might as well fucking for some money. You see, bro, <laughs> I had this. I had the same talk with one of my older cousins, bro. And I, I just, I wasn't buying it. You Pay for pussy? Saying? Yeah. So you never bought bitch enough food? I mean, yes, but I didn't. Buy, you ever, I didn't smoke the bitch. You ever smoke the bitch out? You feel me? Anything that I've ever did for a bitch, it was not so she can have sex with me. But it, don't, it don't get no more it's not, hamburger it's not, than it's that. It's not because no, like. It's not because you want. It's not about the sex, but I'm saying, but your friends have a certain limit to what they can get. You dig know what I'm saying? As far as like, your bitch can get this, that, and a third. Your friend might can get this, that, and okay, a third. You dig know yeah, what I'm saying? Yeah, 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 yeah. Whole different ball game. So if I put you in the rank of I'm trying to fuck and you trying to give me pussy, I'm gonna treat you a little bit different than I treat my friend. And that's, and that's fair. That makes sense. That makes and sense. So you gonna get things, and my friends are like, yeah, and, that's, you know and, that's, and that's a fact. But you're not gonna pay your partner's rent. And that no. He my point. I'm not but gonna pay your bitch rent. <laughs> but, but if it's your wife, but you get my point though. I'm not saying you'll pay your bitch rent, but you get my point. <laughs> no. Just using that. Because anything, so, anything that I've ever done for a bitch, if, if I bought her some food, if it was whatever, no, regardless of what it was, it wasn't for no coochie, bro. Because y'all know what do I always say? If a bitch wanna fuck you, she's going to fuck you. Simple. It don't matter. Simple. So therefore, anything that I, if I bought a bitch some food, bro. I would just I, I must have must was have been high feeling nice and was just feeling generous or whatever. <laughs> that's the bitch out. Yes, but no, that's, I, but would that's you know ugly like bitch out. No, my point. No, so exactly. <laughs> but the thing is, you but do the, shit for the pussy, then you would do. No, different I don't. I don't get bitches high to have sex, but, but it's something about that, that, that don't because sit right with what, what he's but. saying. What he's saying is the intent behind it matters. If if I'm only giving you this just to give it to you, and then if you so happen, yours is cause and effect. I'm giving you this, so you're gonna give me the pussy. His is my intent behind giving you this was not to get the pussy, but okay. it just so happened to happen. So there we'll, we'll go to inbox in. We'll go to inbox in. Inbox not is inbox free. In. in a way, because you still gotta pay for your phone to talk to bitches. I'm weak as fuck. Get on, buy dude. How about that? I don't pay for my phone to talk to bitches though. That's not why I pay my phone. Bitch. He pays his phone, but it's included. You know why? But I pay it's I know why I pay my phone, but it's included though. Of course, my point. That's <laughs> <laughs> all so I'm saying, my nigga. Yeah, I'm gonna pay for it. Some way you pay for pussy, like in some roundabout way. 
in, in, in all fairness, in all fairness, I was getting coochie when my when I when I didn't have a phone. Let me go. I'm, I'm just leaving. Just that say there. that there. So why niggas got nice clothes, nice cars, nice houses, and shit like that? To impress bitches. That definitely to impress bitches. That's so you gotta pay for bills and all that shit to get what? Pussy. But so what's the difference? Are we speaking, if he are we speaking it for you? Are we speaking, doing it for me? Yeah. Are we speaking from a general standpoint? Or, or from a standpoint? man's standpoint? General, general standpoint. I don't think, okay, look, when niggas have nice cards and shit, they don't do it solely, solely for bitches. But niggas, they do that Sometimes shit for themselves. Do it for I'm saying they do it for themselves, <laughs> but the, like I just said about right the phone about bill. Like I just said about the Weird. phone bill and the phone. The pussy is included. Okay, if the, pussy is, if the pussy is included, then that means it's not for, for the, the coochie. Pussy. It's not for the coochie. So but I'm saying, I'm I never said it was for the pussy. I'm saying in some roundabout way, you pay for that motherfucker. No. 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 <laughs> no. What? Yes. No. I said, what? That's how? <laughs> because it's again. Maybe I'm going. Maybe I'm just confused. Maybe I'm some ballistics to our men, bro. It maybe I'm just confused. To, Somebody explain to, to me. Intent. If you're only doing, if you're only doing it to get the pussy, then that's different. Just like what you said. If you go uh, smoke a three five with a bitch and buy her some pizza, you go. You're gonna expect, expect some, some coochie. coochie. Me? No, I'm not expecting some coochie. I would like some. Coochie. You would like okay. Right. I would like some coochie. Right, and you know, so say say you hanging with this one bitch. You know, when she okay. smokes, she likes to suck dick. Say say that. Say you hanging. How many HDs are you gonna roll up? Now that's intense. Old pack, nigga, three. <laughs> <laughs> that, that's big bloods, bitch. Go ahead. That's smoking smoking with the intent to get pussy. Now, if he goes over oh, this one girl house, and you know this, this they first time, you know, linking up. So she I, smoke, I'm, they I'm, smoke. Yeah, we're going to smoke. We're that's going to smoke. Saying, that's just off top. But he's not doing it too fuck. That's kind of different though, because it's pre, it's preconceived notions before you get over exactly. there. You don't know if you're gonna fuck. Intent. It's all about intent. It, and it, it matters in what you. I might buy. I'm about that. Okay, my bad. I might buy, I, I, I might buy a nigga, you know, a nice meal, little burger or something. If I'm trying to fuck. Oh, fuck, fuck, fuck. You want to fuck, fuck with a strawberry lemonade? I can understand that. I, okay. Like ice. Nigga better get you some 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 uh some crab legs or something, huh? Oh, God, nigga. Fuck I you talking about these oxtails, bitch. What you mean? Get me right. In these oxtails. Oh, my God. They're so fucking I kinda heavenly. Get, I kind of get what you're saying. Who, me? Yeah. Uh, Thank you. In a roundabout way, it's coming back because, to Because, like, if I you don't. think about it, like, if you're in a relationship, look, look, if you think about it, if you're in a relationship, you're going on dates, you're going on, you're not, you're not doing the intent to get pussy, but you, in a way, you, that's what you're getting in return. No, no. When you in relationships, bro, that's what you do, bro. Y'all go on dates and sex all that. Is and, an exchange. And, and, and y'all have sex. That's what y'all do. Because y'all are in a relationship. Come on, yes, that's what y'all do. Not because you're not paying her bills. There's not relationships. There's plenty of bitches. Wait, You get over every bitch house expecting not to fuck. Yeah. Yes. Bro. Expecting not every to time fuck. I go over a girl house, I don't automatically think I'm I didn't, getting coochie. I didn't say automatically. I'm just saying you go over every Expect, every ex- female yard except the house. ones he was intending to fuck before he got there. No, no, no. Are you talking about the ones? Are we I'm talking about talking females about, that I've cracked up before or that I've haven't I, cracked? Because if if I've you, never you, listen, you, listen, you listen. add that if you want to. I'm just saying every female that you you've ever came encounter with, every female. <laughs> she said, "Could y'all stop saying coochie? That's what it's called, coochie." There's <laughs> <laughs> yeah, some. Say eating coochie do get sound different. Like coochies gets like a, coochie. it's like a, it's like a fruit. Yeah. No, it's not. <laughs> I'm yes, eating a little coochie fruit. <laughs> a little coochie oh, fruit. God, a little coochie she fruit. That don't sound bad. Yeah, yeah, I just had some coochie <laughs> fruit earlier. Know, back to my point. But if every Tasty. bitch in your, in, in your catalog, regardless, they friends, you done crack buns or something else. You go to every bitch house expecting not to fuck. Yes, no, nah, that's a fact. That's a fact. When I and go if home, it just so happens to happen, it, it, it's up. But if I go over there, or if they had a conversation beforehand about it, then that's what y'all doing. Then again, it's like if, if I go over there during the explain. daytime, mm-hmm. you know, we we gonna just we probably gonna just chill. I ain't really looking looking for that. But if it's like booty call, two o'clock, yeah, bro, in the morning, come on now, bro. Well, can, you can't dif- differentiate the two. But yes, when you, you come in there, you just said you're not you just said you're not going over there to get pussy. So that means all across the board, you can be like, no, nope, I'm not going to fuck automatically. It don't matter if it's at ten o'clock or at then twelve o'clock. Come on now, yeah, let's be real. Let's be real. Let's be real. If, if I get out my bed, call hours. You gotta put gas in your car, so you technically are paying. Go for ahead, make your point, cause I'm about to. Oh, go ahead, I know what you're about to say. Go ahead, make your point. Y'all are backwards. Y'all don't, yeah, so if you hold on, if you get out the bed at twelve o'clock, if you if you get out the bed at twelve o'clock to go over a bitch house expecting to crack buns, how is it any different than me bringing a pizza and a three five over a bitch house and expecting to crack buns? Because you're doing bringing the pizza and the three five, he's just bringing the dick. I'm bringing myself. I'm giving you my. I just told you my pussy is my time, my value, listen, and my, my money. Pussy. That's my pussy. Uh, um, y'all make people listen. Uh, 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 <laughs> y'all are doing the most. I'm just making it make sense. One more time. One more time. One more time. <laughs> listen. What time did you go over her house with the eighth, bro? In the pizza. It's like nine o'clock. Nine nine thirty. In a, in, Nigga, at you night, chose to at go night. at that time. 
Thank you. Oh, so you told us to go at twelve o'clock. Good. If y'all did, if y'all okay, if if y'all only attend in nine out of ten, y'all only attended to go over there and get some cheap take y'all take stay. I That's not my intent, but I would it like but it. Y'all, I would oh, like. Oh, I buy pizza. I play games. It's different. It's different. Nobody actually do that shit. He only went over there. He went over there to hang out. If they fuck, it's cool. If he goes over there, you go, you you go over here with food and weed. Like, I'm not saying, no, 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 that's not what I'm saying. That's that's what that's saying. That's that's that wasn't the intent. I'm just saying. If the pussy was thrown my way, I would have, I would have liked a piece of coochie. Is my point. I like the option. I just like the option to have a piece of coochie. That's my only point. I just like the option. But if you bought her something, you were thinking that when you bought a bottle of beer. But you, you bought the it. bottle of beer. Oh, okay. <laughs> See, <laughs> I, okay, I you see somebody, right. I see somebody <laughs> in the comments say, like, you're a pussy. When I say my pussy, I mean something that holds value to me or holds, like, wait, you dig what I'm saying? It holds some type of substantial like how value. Baby, like how women feel about their coochie. Exactly. You know what I'm some women. And half the time. Don't even be all that. don't even value y'all pussies. Just, no, 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 no. Say that again, Quay. It don't even be all that. <clears throat> With the, the value of the time of the pussy. Yeah. The pussy don't be all that. Oh, that that the homies. Dicks don't be all that either. But we, yeah. that, that's, that's facts. A, niggas, that's a big cap. conversation. Big, big, that is a different okay. conversation. I just feel like I just like this. Do big if you lay there big. and you like you get, uh, 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 and you get lay there, uh, 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 <laughs> I just kind of feel like that's on you. Pretty much. You should have said something. Shit. You should have said nah, something. Nah, that's, nah, that's facts. Oh, my tail. I got my nut at the end of the day, bitch. <laughs> I'm Gucci. But they don't know how it's, to do none of that. It's, it's, it's not hard to turn a nigga on. Yeah, it's, it's not hard. Make him a light. I put my hands on him. Look at that. Look at that. It's the girl that y'all put with. All because of the three extra guys. Nigga. 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 It's nasty bitch. It's nasty bitch. It's nasty bitch. <laughs> but my bad. I'm we're getting off topic. Yeah, we're getting Slide to the next one. Slide to the next one. Who next? You um Bree. Bree. Bree, go ahead. Oh, okay. she finna start some shit, by the way. Y'all yeah, know I love the mess. <laughs> <laughs> I just like make sure y'all like, share, comment, all that yes, good stuff. Yeah, to break house. Okay. The number is 816 622 2256 Hey man, can somebody Period. pour some liquor in this, man? Tap in. Okay. Oh, but no, fucks, my ignorant weekly is who you lies go more. Man, come on, man, come on, 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 because we don't, I will say that bitches. We I'm, okay, we got I, 17 I, views. I, I you feel like keep liking I, the when I lie, it's because I don't want to get in trouble. Anytime I lie, I don't want to get in trouble. That's my first thought when I lie. I don't want to get in trouble. We ain't gonna go there. What do I need to lie for you? Lie to you for? I can't, but some people can just be because y'all know, can't handle the truth. They don't be. I can't. Y'all can't handle the truth either. Cry. That's why y'all be there. If you tell it from, if you say it from the beginning, that's a whole different ball game. This track about us. But hey. Nah, if you say the truth from the beginning, I it's a whole different ball I game. I definitely can handle the truth. You know what I'm saying? Nah, I don't that's all I require. Y'all start that's what writing this tracks and shit. And like, so room. say, for what? Playing sad ass music, crying. Just, say that again. I ain't hear you. Niggas make this tape. I said, nah, y'all start crying. I need that real quick. Well, the day I diss a bitch, the day I hop in the studio and diss a bitch, she gonna be sick. <laughs> oh, God. I'm not, I'm not That's letting her do stupid Talk bad. shit. That's all y'all do. Like I, I think, I, again, if, if that's I think the case, women lie more so about, about. Women lie more. About I think little shit. It'd be the little dumbest shit. shit. It'd be the littlest the shit, shit that because women lie yeah, about. And it only and it only be because I say for myself, I'm not gonna say for women in general, but for myself, when I lied previously i'll say in my previous relationship when i lied i was in fear of there being a problem so like i can't just tell you i'm at my friend stacy house because you're not gonna believe i'm just at my friend stacy house you think i'm at my friend stacy mm-hmm. house I'm with okay. a nigga and we're doing this this and this so i gotta but i feel like that's because of previous lies you may have told you dig what i'm saying or previous actions you may have showed to show that nigga like oh you might, you might not be yep. a stacy house bitch you at daryl house yep or it could be just him or him 
Are you single? That's different. Are you single? I know. I speak to this point because like, are you single? Me? Are you single? Yes. Oh, okay. I feel like Montel can talk about this. If there ain't no ring, then there ain't no point of explaining anything. Oh, say that, say right. that to all the say that to all the sad bitches. Yeah, all right. right. Y'all say that yeah. now. I was like, yeah, all right. That's not fair. They say yeah, that until they start fair. liking a nigga. That's not fair. Explain, please it's, explain it's, that it's, shit to me. It's not. It's Brianna, not, that's it's cat. Explain that shit. To me. So you want you want to question your nigga about if, nothing? If I, I ask you, explain it to me. So if you had a nigga, don't explain it to me. So if it was you and your man's right, and he cheated on you. Or you find out he was fucking another bitch. You want to question about it? Yeah, you're going to be sick. Why would I have to question him? He cheated. You know. There ain't no, there's no more relationship. Because I don't care why. Why not? For what? If he cheated. You just said if there's you no ring, there's, no, there's nothing else. So therefore, what, did he yeah. do anything wrong? Yeah, he did something wrong. How? But if, if he I, cheated. If he, if he, oh. if he. Not to, she said there was no reason to explain it. So why am I explaining myself if, what the fuck are they talking to you about? He, I'm not going to ask you for no explanation. Right, so if you're not married, why am I not in a relationship? Look, let me just break this down short and simple. Because all of y'all asking me the same question. Just in different ways. I don't care. I just want some liquor, man. In the cup, please. If, he, if, wow. if we ain't got no ring, and you you take it upon yourself. If, if we have a, com, a common some, conversation about what we are to each other, and you take it upon yourself to go out and you cheat, I'm not gonna ask you for no explanation. What do I need? To, what do I need to ask you? Well, why you cheat? True. That hurt in me. Those specific you knew situation. what the fuck you was doing when you put your dick in her. So why do I need to ask you a question about what the fuck you did? You know you did it, right? Right. You know what you did when you knew what you were doing when you drove over there. You know what you did when you pulled your pants down, and you knew what you did when you was fucking her. So what? What's, what's the point of me asking you that? But why does it even that matter yeah, if we don't have a ring? Like, I shouldn't have to tell you none of that shit. Like, wait, what, if, if, if I went no, over there to go get the thing, I'm not asking. But I'm for saying, it. what's the problem though? Like, what? Why are you leaving? Why are you breaking up with him? What's the problem? You just said she if it said, ain't she said, right? she didn't she said what's the issue? She wait, 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 wait. A sign of disrespect. So let a bitch cheat on y'all, and then y'all can come. Okay. Talk. I never said. Right. I never said. All right. I was just asking. Wait, wait, what was I was just asking. And it's, it's not me. I'm not. I'm not mad or anything. But I'm saying, let somebody cheat on y'all, and then y'all come and have a conversation with me. I'm I was not just. Gonna have I, a, I was not, just asking. But we was the. We not the ones who said if, if there's wait, not a ring. Like we, none of us said. There's no ring. There's no what? No what? There's no point of me explaining it. I'm. I don't. So even if y'all in a relationship, there's no. Like if say I do something to piss you okay. off, if I okay, I just said if me and you have an understanding of what we are mm -hmm. to each other, and you do some shit that's you outside do, of yeah, that, yeah, outside of that, there's no need for a conversation after yeah, that. There's no need for okay. it. If I find out you cheated, what do you come? She's in? saying she don't need his explanation. I don't need your explanation. She don't. So need you his only need an explanation when you're married. No, what I'm saying is this: if me and you, okay, if me and somebody are talking or in a relationship, or whatever, and we have an understanding of what what line not to cross and you take it upon yourself to go and do that there's no conversation needed i'm not having no conversation there's no like there's not gonna be no rebuttal about well what can we do to make this work you oh, obviously so she's saying uh, like a she's saying conversation it's not of a it's it can't be you can't because you y'all are Y'all took vows. Y'all took vows. You know, it's like, it's, it's different. God, it's but I, I'm mm -hmm. no, no, no. I feel like that's that's more or less on cheating, that though. <laughs> that's on cheating. Very. <clears throat> but we, I mean, we can use that. But okay, same example. We can use that. I mean, I can get rid of a marriage the same way I can get rid of a relationship. If I don't want to be with no, you, bitch, not. I don't have to be with you at all. Like, period. I don't have to. It's, I don't you might be separated for a year before yeah, you can even get a divorce. Yeah, it's paperwork. You think I can disappear for a year? That's why I don't. You think a nigga can disappear for a year? You think a nigga can disappear for a year? I mean, you could. Definitely be easy, but you're still legally what married, what so you can't go you? and do shit until y'all break up. Hey. And see, I divorce because anything you do in that the time of y'all separation so can be put on divorce papers, and she could take all your shit because of the fling you had within mm. your year. Mm. That's is mm. sick. That's <laughs> oh that's my fuck. god. That's that's, 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 nigga, that's if a, they that's don't a, sign a, a prenup, girl. I'm not signing no prenup. That's Bro, that if, shit sounds that's I'm not signing that's no prenup. No, that's I'm saying that's only if they don't sign a prenup. If he cheats on her and she signed that prenup, that's not, oh yeah, that's not what well, she ain't getting nothing. That's such a sick way to think, yo. Don't go into marriage just thinking you're about to get half, yo. Or just in, I don't in the marriage, that's, that's not, money, bro. I, that's I don't such a sick way to think, yo. You can keep your money and I can keep mine. I, I love that mindset. I love that mindset. Dead homies. I love, I love that mindset. Mm -hmm. a, lot that, of, a lot of um. Yeah. That then depends. Quite said depends. Depends. Well, nah, you came in with a trash bag, you bitch you leaving with a trash and bag. And if you came in this motherfucker with a trash yeah. bag and you left out with a motherfucker def a Louis V duffel bag, but, my nigga. Hold on. My but, nigga. But I'm coming up off half that duffel bag. If we and if you didn't come in with shit and we built it. It depends together, on what you contributed. If, we, no, if you didn't contribute if, yeah, shit, true. I'm not that doing man, shit. That okay. man shit is well, what, just well, what so if y'all have kids? 
He said, what? What if y'all have kids? Y'all gonna have to have... If you can't take care of the kids, y'all get to me so I can take care of you. No, that's not how it works. How come? It's not because at the end of the day, the kids need both parents, not just one. I never said the kids gonna have both parents. What gives you more... What gives you more... More as a mother to have the kids. You dig what I'm saying? Why do you get to have the kids and I get to just give you money to get take care of the kids? Why no, can't I have those kids? Why don't and you, I take because care of them? They, you get on your feet? Why, okay. Hold on, they feel finish. like, they feel like since they carry them, then... then. God damn it, both of y'all go. Shit. No, yeah. no, I'm saying if that's the case, if you feel that way, then why don't y'all both parents have a conversation with a fund that y'all open up for y'all kids and invest money into for that the for the kids and invest in the day. That way you don't have to worry about the situation. Us money but and I can all still do that while taking care of my kids myself. True. Great. And most divorces, they have. The kids need most both. divorces. I never said that you I never. Most divorces have quick. parental. Guidance. Like, yeah, I've never they, said they that you couldn't come you see your kids and get your kids on the weekend. I never right. see that. You would just no. be a weekend mom, just like niggas a weekend dad. I'm exactly. pretty sure your kids ain't gonna want to just want to be in one household. But, but how is it any different than a mom just having the kid all the time and he go see the daddy on the weekends? I'm not saying the woman right either. Again, I don't well, think the kids should be on in just one if, household. I but that's, think it's but that's fair. If you sign a prenup and you don't have nothing when you leave this relationship, I will keep the... I, that's fair enough to say I'll keep the kids until you can find something stable. I'll yeah. make sure that they're safe. No. And I won't Boy, keep them mar- from you once you become stable. That'd be, the, that'd be the problem. I, that I once. Opinion. Once they asking, asking. once they become stable, it's the not allowing them to get them after that. That's when it becomes a problem. If I need to get my life together for six, for a couple of months and I'm still making an effort to see my kids, but I can't keep them, I feel like you should be able to you know pick up that responsibility and I can give where, where I can, uh-huh. mother or father, uh-huh. just so Maybe they can okay. just just so they can they don't have to see the parents struggle. Nobody likes seeing their they parents struggle. Facts. And what do you? Yeah, I'm sitting here. Str- I'm sitting here struggling with my two kids and trying to raise them by myself instead of just letting them go live with their dad, mm-hmm. you know, and let him take care of them. Nigga, my head millions. You dig what I'm saying? They could right. be living like the Jackson lifestyle. Nigga, I'm well, not so much. The I know. I know. Little boosie baby mamas be dumb sick, boy. Nigga, hurt. <laughs> they be dumb hurt. On God. But uh, no, they don't never uh, want to go I home to their mamas. Everybody mind tell me. Nah, man, but we at BLE Studios, man. It's popular ignorance episode. Make sure y'all like, and share, comment, and comment. Share and shit. Damn, homies, keep commenting for sure, for sure. Facts. Uh, when y'all want to read some of these comments on the <laughs> on this shit, man, because listen, we got some shit going on. Man. Martelli, do the honors, please. Martel been in the comments since day one. <laughs> yeah, oh god, Martel. It's a lot of these. Read some said, comments. said, "How's it hard to turn a man on? It's not." Like oh, I said, yo, you just rub my balls the right way. You rub my ear, bitch, I'm there. It just, it, it just depends on the every, bitch. Every man is different. It may take a little bit longer. Every just, man is different. It just depends on the bitch. Some some girl, some women don't have to do every nothing. You could just different. walk in that motherfucker Blake, and be like, yeah, hey, bitch. babe. And then, boom, it's, it's, it's up from there. And then some bitches, right. just like, like they be touching the you block. and you just be like, ooh. 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 Like, like, Lucha, yeah. them some, some girl, some girl, like, yeah, you better get pregnant. Have you ever, like, had a girl, like, he just that nasty ass look like she finna like and she start trying to touch you like oh my god like you know chill you better stop you feel like a nigga and it's just like a bitch like bitch stop and it's just oh oh stop a tingle like the shit that fucks with your brain and she ain't the comments (laughs) sensational go ahead Marcel I'm gonna keep my comments to myself but yeah you read comments it it depends it depends on the bitch B Jackson says speak for yourself Quay what. What? Read the comments, brother. Uh, Ron Shay says they both lie equally. Niggas lie about little, little stupid shit. Bitches be be lying about who their kids' father are. (laughs) (laughs) Oh shit! (laughs) Damn! Shit! Shit. Damn! I was not expecting that at all. That was it. (laughs) She shooting strays at niggas. Oh, but little God. shit to uh, you, yeah, little shit to you could be big shit to somebody else. A lie is a lie. Exactly. A lie, yeah. A lie, a, a lie is a lie, but they all e- they all yeah. equal to me. Because if you lie about some little shit, you lie about some big shit. Facts. A lie is a lie Facts. to me. And everybody like, lies, so let's not. Everybody lies. Every, they, everybody tells a little white lie. I just lie hard. I don't. I'm gonna look. You got one time. <laughs> I'm just fucking with you, Craig. Go ahead. I'm just fucking with you. I didn't hear what you said. I said bitches lie more. They do, but, but go ahead with your comments. But, right but you're right though. Everybody do lie. Um, and she right niggas. Yeah, some niggas like, do lie about, so about just help. like I yeah, don't. Some niggas. N- we not talking about you. Uh, we talking about niggas. Period. You about they they be like, like, no, I don't have no bitches. Talk, and right, then you right go right to now, their Facebook and right, you see the right now. I'm talking about niggas. Like sometimes, <laughs> sometimes niggas do be lying about like the dumbest shit. No, I'm not fucking with nobody else. Yeah, bro. Yes, you are. You yes, have my cousin. I seen it. I seen but the see, messages. Stop. Bitches got 
See, look, don't even go. Hey, look. What is it? Bitches got their badge, yo. <laughs> no, because no, bitches, bitches, bitches got, got their badge. That, that part Don't of line, with, they got that, that, that part of line. Do you line, fuck like, with no, anybody else? That, no, that no, shit? no, no, no. I'm mean as far as what you can say. You saying you fuck with my cousin. Nigga. Nah, hold, what? Nah. I'm saying what bitches part? fuck part? with. Bro, bitches are fuck, bro. Because you know I was going with it. Look, let me not go there. You knew I was going with it. Oh, my. Because boy, I get to talk so What? Line about fucking with. Nah, like, no, 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 I was about, about to say cubs. something as far as about the cubs. females about going the cubs. around and like frequenting. Next thing, no, what I was saying. As soon as you and a bitch break up, boy, she going to the next one, cuz. I'm not about to look, look going to the next one. Like that picture, I know what picture, like that picture. Y'all think they slick, dead homies. Y'all need to be careful who y'all be. Everybody, everybody comment who y'all think lie the most. You did what I'm saying? Out of us. Who do y'all think lies the most out of us? Nah, for real, though. D. And now y'all, yeah, I'm finna say, D. they better not try D. to say D. I'm gonna like be lying to everybody. Oh, oh. Not on purpose, though. Oh, it depends, it depends on, on what we are. I don't be lying. It depends on what we're talking about. Look at my, look at my tail. I ain't gotta lie about shit. It depends on what we're talking about. It depends on what we're talking about. Do you be lying about shit? I'm the truth, boy. About what exactly, though? If you got, like, if you fuck with somebody seriously or if you got a bitch or fuck with somebody. What I lie about? Like, what I lie about? That's August a conversation we're we gonna have off the show. <laughs> I wanna know what I, I lied about. You my friend, I'm not gonna air no dirty laundry. Dirty laundry. You know what? I'm about, about to tell you to do it, English 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 but I just don't think I want I'm Actually, not I'm not sure if I want that. <laughs> <laughs> That's what I'm saying. I'm not sure if I want that. So yeah. Actually, Next topic. Before before we go into our popular ignorance, Mother's Day is May tenth, right? Woo-woo. May tenth. So Sorry, we Sorry, I'm back. So if you haven't Ooh. already and you have a good relationship with your mom, make sure y'all go out there and buy her a little dollar card, two dollar card, little rose, you know, something sweet. Tell her that you love her. Give her a kiss go, on her cheek. Just simply go spend some time. Go with spend her. some time you know with her. You know, she's not doing shit. Damn, there's nothing to do. Shit <laughs> so yeah, you know, make sure y'all go out. And y'all shout out to, to and shout mama. out to all the moms out shout there out too, to the moms. man. You know, so we wouldn't be here without y'all. Anybody got a special message for their moms or anything Yo, like that? I love my mom. Like shout out to her. Well, I, I just want to say I love you. When I, I love I love my mama to death. I talk to my mama every day. Who's on the phone? Who's on the phone at like five o'clock this morning? Every day. Five o'clock this morning. Mm-hmm. Montel. Anything you want to say to your mom? I love you. I love you. That's all I want to say. I love you. You said that shit like Shaq. That's so all I want to say. Uh, Ma, I love you. <laughs> Barbecue Kobe. chicken. <laughs> Kobe <laughs> Bryant. Uh, Fifty point, fifty point. Uh, I told him to give right, me fifty. All right, my turn. I got twenty sixty. My, my turn. <laughs> Go ahead, man. Love you, ma. That was Sis, it. AKA my bestie. Man, if you got any special love comments you, you want to leave for your mom. Yes, leave your special message for your mom. Actually, I think my mama, my mama, my mama actually. Mom. Um, I hope this is not true, but I think she watched the show. You do what I'm saying. So she seen that clip last that's, week. That's what I'm saying. That's why I hope this is not true. <laughs> <Hold on. laughs> Me and my, yo, listen, so I'm sitting there with my tail, we smoking or whatever, right? And I see somebody share the shit, the clip last week, and I'm like, holy fuck, that's my mom. Oh. Ah. So she shared it, she got like 10 likes on this shit. Oh. Like, ah. Them, well, you know, them all. Oh, niggas. Oh, my God. I said, mama, yo. Yeah. Said, baby, did you, did you? I ain't gonna say what friend, but one of her friends. Never mind. Ah. Like I said, I ain't gonna say what friend, but one of her friends. You did what oh, you like, you like to get your butt ate. Oh. <laughs> What's it supposed to say? Like Brianna, what did you do? He said this shit lit. So yeah, you said, said it. You said it on the show, not me. That shit is lit. Can't be pussy, my man. Boy, you like eating your butt? Eh? <laughs> he said. Your mama said they're gonna be like at the cookout, be like, "Oh, you do a podcast." I said they're gonna be like, "Oh, so you like to get your butt ate, huh?" <laughs> <laughs> they're gonna do that little laugh. <laughs> <laughs> Remember your old nasty ass. ass. You nasty ass. Come here, fuck a boy. I'm good. I'm good. 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 Ooh, you old nasty bitch. I love old so that means she ain't got no technique <laughs> joke. Denitria back Denitria. in action. <laughs> Nigga, Denitria, yes. Denitria. Oh. oh my god. Respecting you as such. Yeah, Anywho, man, oh, what's it? Are we getting the topic? Yes. Uh, it's, 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 so, it's cold outside. I'm about to show the motherfuckers it's cold outside. A bit Shit. more of a serious, more serious topic. Uh, <laughs> just to start us off. Um, so, how would you react if your friend was pressing? Um, a man or a woman for sex or you had heard that they had been um, accused of violating somebody that way um, how would how would you react and like how I'm would your relationship go from there I'm not rolling I'll pack his ass out 
I felt that's, that. That's, yep. That's Simple. Point, pretty point much. Six. I'm going to beat your ass in there. I'm not going to talk to you. That's not, I'm not wrong with that. Yep. Pretty Male much. or female. That pretty shit much. is that yeah. shit is just Fuck like, Kelly. that shit does not fly. Like, there's been girls, like, who. It's never that serious. It's never that serious, bro. It's, it's motherfuckers out here serious, slanging bro. that shit yeah. for free. There's too many berries to pick. I ain't going to say. I ain't gonna say fishes in the sea because I don't like fishy bitches. Yeah, so like, <laughs> that's, that's my personal yeah, preference. I don't, I don't want you to smell like fish in water now. Now a berry, now you can smell like a berry. <laughs> I, got I, a love with no berries. I love my fruit. Shut <laughs> the fuck up, mangoes and shit. Straight out, nigga. Coochie fruit. Coochie fruit. Coochie fruit. Coochie fruit. I try to tell you niggas just have some coochie of that. Coochie fruit. Early. Put a little of that coochie what? fruit on your skin. That and that. The CJ, but. Well, yeah, that too. I mean, <laughs> everything, everything. But, but listen, um, nah, but I want to know. I want to know what would you do, Bree, if you found out that your, uh, if you, if you found out your friend male was friend like, or female. No, nah, if you found out your female friend was like, just being thirsty over some meat. <laughs> <laughs> I really feel like that would be on. Dude, <laughs> that's crazy. Dude, that's crazy. Like, what you mean? Oh my god, y'all are. Okay, repeat the question to me so I can make sure I answer. How would you react if your friend uh, was pressing a man for sex or had been accused of violating somebody in that way? We don't have a problem. So if you found out like a female friend raped a nigga, <laughs> like took it from him type shit, like drugged him, like say she like Bill Cosby. some Cardi B type shit. Yeah, 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 Cardi B type shit. That situation was weird as fuck. We're not. Uh, different topic, we're different not topic, friends. different topic. Go ahead. We're not friends. Ahead. It's not even that we're not friends, bitch. I'm telling. I'm telling everybody. I'm letting everybody know you're a fucking rapist. <laughs> That's weird no. as fuck. I want everybody to no. steer clear of your weird no. ass. No. Why? No. And this bitch no. going, uh, so. She taking this. Damn, time, damn, gangster. So you tell me I'm about to take it from you. Shut the fuck up. You take it upon yourself. You don't say nothing to police. That was wrong. That's like when no, he I said he don't say nothing to white people. Rachel, that your friend that say you're not crazy gonna, shit. Gonna, no, I'm telling everybody. She she's gonna, she would be she's gonna feel me. Yes. Yeah, me. Then I'm gonna tell everybody. Yeah, 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 if, my, if, my, if my bro, if one of my mans, like if he if he raped, I've actually been through this before. Um, and no, we didn't call the police on him, and we didn't beat his ass either. But we did. We definitely did. Like stop fucking with him. Like that type of shit. Um, that's, I'm that's about to say not, that shit. That shit not okay. You do what I'm saying. I feel like um, if you if you if you pressing a bitch for some coochie, I mean I'ma just I ain't gonna if you just pressing her for some coochie, I'ma just clown you, boy, because what you being thirsty for? You know what I'm saying? But if you like if you trying to take it, bro, different, totally different bargain. That shit's never you, that, that shit's never never on. acceptable under any circumstances, bro. Like, bro, it's, it's never acceptable, bro. Like, cause like my boy said, bro, it's never that serious, bro. It's never that serious. It's so much pussy out here, bro. And so the reason coochie. I say I would I would tell is because I want I want it to be. You're not gonna tell the police. Not the police, tell, right. but like but public gonna, opinion type. Yeah, thing. like public. If if the person that it happened to felt okay with you know me letting them letting people know who did what, not you know what happened to her specifically, but or who she specifically was. But if they didn't have a problem with me putting them out there, of course mm-hmm. I would, because I just like they have the the sex offenders list for a reason. And yeah, just because you didn't make it, don't one. mean motherfuckers don't need to know you're offending motherfuckers with your sex. Facts. Keep that shit to yourself. It's bitches out here that will sell you they pussy, that will give you they pussy, that will will put that motherfucker on you just because. Yeah, put your pussy Yo. lips on live. On live. $1,000. And he sent them bitches 15 so. I mean, but listen, some of the bitches' pussy lips weren't worth that whole thousand dollars. <laughs> some of y'all should kind of blown out. Y'all, y'all motherfuckers are worth like 200 maybe. Now. Long 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 out, like, listen, like, long no, ladies does no, not mean no, you had a lot of sex. No, no, so no. I was about to elaborate. Long labias does not mean you have a Looking Let's like elephant right ears and shit. Oh, the auto zone. You think what I'm saying? Long that labias. That nigga said elephant ears. Long, long labias does not mean you had a lot of sex. Motherfucker. No, but that's, 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 not, that's, not, that's not what we were saying. It's ugly. I, it's, I, don't I, think, want, I don't think it's ugly. I don't like it. You don't think it's ugly? I'm going to steal the motherfucker. What? So like, the motherfucker just flat by like. I'm going to steal eat that motherfucker. Yes. Yes. Like this, like it's. <laughs> nigga in there making a subway sandwich. I happen to like Arby's, okay? You, you like, you like. Ew. I happen to like Arby's. You got the okay? meat. So I know you do. Good. You sick fuck. That's Arby's nasty, is bro. good. <laughs> Me personally, Black Forest you ham is fire as fuck. Black. I don't want to see it on no coochie. But. That's what we're calling it for now. Black, black pussies, we call it black forest. Black forest ham. Damn. That's what we call it. That does now. not sound appealing. At all. <laughs> oh God! No, 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 no,
I never I said, oh, I'm not changing my mind. All I said was how it sound. I'm still shaved eating that Pam. Pam. Like You got shaved Pam down, down there. <laughs> ah! I'm up in it. You remember how we said last week, like, how it's all up on your face like that? You know what I'm saying? That I need, I told I need you. like, love your face. Yeah, it's like that. To where it's like, yeah, I need I need that. You know what I'm saying? Oh, God. All right, next question. All right. Next topic. Oh, fuck. Oh, my God. Your face is nice. All right. Yeah, but, um, pretty much. Next topic. Another next scenario. Topic, on, another right. scenario. So, this kind of goes back to, like, how kid, how people are with their kids. So, people who don't. So, say you were dating somebody or you're friends with somebody. Um, matter of fact, it says friends. Um, could you be friends with somebody who does not take care of their kids? No. Absolutely not. Oh, my God. Absolutely not. I feel like there's kind of a lot of different variables to that situation, but if all around, like, if your baby mama's letting you see your kids, you like, like, not, niggas, like, like niggas running around here acting like they don't have kids. Yeah. You know yeah. what I'm saying? Like that niggas shit, move to that different states. Cool. That shit not cool. That's Weird. dead. That's not I can't cool fuck with you. Weird. Them type of niggas get zero respect for me. Because everybody I mean, said, you can't be loyal to your kid. How the fuck you going to be loyal to me? You, you feel I me? I can't fuck with you. Not for real. Y'all need to be Weird. playing these little pics. Oh, God. <laughs> <laughs> I'm dead. They they is up there. Too. <laughs> I that shit. But um, nah, yeah. Utilize um, it. Yeah, that shit. If you, I don't like. I mean, I get, I get. Sometimes shit gets spunky. Sometimes with you and the child, and the uh, the child's mother, and I'm not gonna like judge any of that because mm-hmm. I don't have kids. And I don't know. But at the same time, if you run around here acting like you don't have kids, mm-hmm. I can, I can't respect you. Facts. I just can't. I, I I don't respect them type of niggas. But I don't get no type of respect from you. It's weird. Too? I ain't wrong with what he said. <laughs> what I, he said? Yeah, and it's nah. I ain't, that's dead. If you can, like you say, if that. you can't be, if you can't be loyal to, my, if you can't be loyal to your kids, how I expect you to be loyal? How are you to gonna you? be more loyal to me than your dad? How did you? How would you deal with that kind of shit? Like when, like when you had like step kids or some shit like that. Like how would you deal with that? Like a dad beat dad. No, you know that if he ain't around, he ain't around. He ain't and around. if he ain't if he has a problem. Pro- I'm not gonna find him if he's fight if he's trying to fight me over a bitch. He, can, I, I'm not going for that. But if it's fight. over, if it's if it's about the child, mm-hmm. then something. we can, then we can have a discussion about it. Right. But if it, if you're trying to come in and fuck up this child's life, I ain't rolling because mm-hmm. right. I'll beat you. Every kid that I, I put in my life, <laughs> I treat him like mine. <laughs> so it's like I treat every kid like <laughs> like mine. So it's like I'm gonna beat your ass up. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna beat your ass up. <laughs> That's the end of it. I'm gonna beat your ass up. You imagine getting your ass beat over your own child. Yeah. Nigga, so imagine if Russell Wilson beat up Future, Chris. Oh, oh, Future gonna pop his ass. Oh, Jesus Christ, he is. Russell Wilson, bro. I respect him. I respect him. Don't get me wrong. I, I definitely respect him. But, but he just. Too much of a ham. Yeah, he's too much. I wouldn't even. I'm not gonna call him a ham. I just hate how he's always like thinking my nigga future is worried about him, bro. Like that's the that's the shit that irritates the fuck. Well, then again, you don't know what. Then again, you don't know what's happening off the camera and behind the scenes. Yeah, you're right about that. Future could be on the nigga's neck, bro. You're right about that, but it just uh, you know, like from a a a fan standpoint, looks different. I don't never really see future say anything about him for real, for real. You don't say much at all. But then, (laughs) then again, you know. Relax. Sierra's his baby mama, so you don't know what he be texting his her wife. phone. That's his or wife. What but that's why I said from a fan standpoint. Yeah. Bitch ass daddy. Yeah. Future. In the house that I paid for. And not her bitch ass, ass daddy. daddy. <laughs> huh? And not her bitch ass daddy. <laughs> but couldn't be me. I got a problem. Nah, uh, I seen a post earlier this week that was kind of talking about uh, Future and, and uh, Sierra. She said what? I don't suck this motherfucker. I'm not. It was like he missed 35% of the scheduled visits or something like that. Some shit like that. percent of the. Oh no, he missed 37. Yeah, 37. Yeah, 35, 37, somewhere in that area. Yeah, and then. Of, of the scheduled visits, and they were saying, like, he's a bad dad, and how he's such an ain't shit person, and he's ain't shit dad. Do y'all feel like. <laughs> how the fuck you supposed to schedule something and not show up for it? Yeah, bro, especially regarding That's your fine. kids. I mean, I get shit happens, especially when you, like, you know, an entertainer and you that big. But I mean, like. Again, I try not to speak on these situations too much because yeah. I don't have kids. But it's like, bro, no. but it's like, can I finish it. talking? Can can he? No, talk your shit. I said, like, bro, no, <laughs> talk your shit. Please, it's continue. like, it's <laughs> like we don't, I don't, we don't know what, what factored, in, what factored into him missing those appointments. But at the same time, it's like y'all scheduled this shit. They didn't. That shit didn't just pop up. Like, yeah, y'all scheduled this shit. So therefore, it's like, you had no reason. You said what? what and we don't even about, know about future. How um. About future missing, how many? What, what was 37. the Thirty-seven percent of his scheduled child, uh, whatever the fuck. And we don't the even know how many visits that was. It could have been literally ten visits. Sierra's, uh, so child. if he missed sixty-three percent of the ten visits, he missed six out of ten visits. How the fuck do you miss six out of the ten visits? I mean, three 
say. Out of the this 10 what I'm saying. that you were supposed to go to. To play devil's advocate, I don't know. Here you go. I don't know Buddy's, like, his schedule. You dig know what I'm saying? So right. I can't say he could have been on tour at the time. That's what I'm fucking know. So I'm saying that I feel like in some circumstances, everybody got to make a sacrifice. Mm-hmm. Especially if I'm getting all this kind of not money, I'm kid, taking though. care of you not and 12 kid. other kids. Not the kid, though. Everybody got to kind of make it. Why not? Everybody got to make that sacrifice. You might have to sacrifice time, but no, hey, because you got this good roof over your head. You got good uh, good shoes on your feet. Not, not, from, your not from just future, though. <laughs> not from future. You got, you got public got, school. Sierra got a life. Get, Sierra got money. Sierra got Russell Wilson money. Bro, 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 shit. Stop bullshitting. Come on, man. Bro, 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 she, she still get money. She not popping. She not popping, but she still get money. Though. Y'all y'all like she's grown, though. Y'all say y'all so like, we not looking for Sierra. We looking for y'all future. Y'all arguing a whole different point. Y'all, 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 we y'all looking for, for, for she wants somebody because he makes music for us. Because he mumbling some shit. Y'all think that's music? The fuck get out of here. Future. What are you talking about? Rap. Exactly what I do. My point is this, my nigga. I'm talking about. When did we start talking about? I'm not talking about music at all. I'm saying this. I'm saying she has Russell Wilson money. Sierra ain't put out a song since how long? She don't have to. That's why. She has put out She has put out songs. You You just don't listen to her. A whole different argument for a whole different day. We're not going to talk about that right now. Because we're bringing in the factor of schedules and him being rich. Okay, Sierra and Russell are both very busy and both very rich. What is the problem? So you think if Sierra... So you think if Future had the kids, Sierra missed ten visits, be a different. It would be a. It would be the. It should be. It should be the exact same. It wouldn't be, but it should, should be, be the exact same. She should be shamed just as much. Understandable. She should be shamed just as much. But if you schedule visits, and again, we don't even know how many visits. It could have been three visits, and that he missed one. If you, if, if you didn't have we shit to do, and you just missed them visits. Right. You a fucked up dad. But I'm right. saying that if you was on tour or some shit like that. Then everybody has to make the that sacrifice. The tour shouldn't even because you it's should. Scheduled. You should but know. Gotta, you yeah. should know yeah. the schedule of your tours. But I don't think I don't know how that really works. Cause I ain't got kids. I don't know who makes the schedule. It's, it's, like, it's, not, it's like bro, you go, you go. Okay, I'll, I'll, tell you you I'll tell you how it goes. I'll tell you how it goes because future's always on. We're drinking the when, when, when it comes to the schedule visit, when it comes to the schedule visit, you'll have it. There's a lawyer there, and the two pairs sit down. They go over the schedule. And most of the time, it happens during court. And y'all have so and y- and y- 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 got you got to sign off on a day. So yeah. it's like, why well, pick a day that you know you're gonna be busy? So okay. it's like, okay, that's understandable because you're putting the money before your kids. So I get, I get that. So point. it's like, I get it's, that point. You, there's no, there's no way in hell you can unless you, unless you, it's an emergency where you have when somebody's either dying or you are going to a hospital. Mm. It's the only time you should miss a bit. I mean, in, in fairness, in fairness, are you got, are, are you, are you just not, at, are you got to work? But I feel like, like sometimes that happens. In fairness, bro, though, Future is saying? always on tour. That's future work. is always tour. He be overseas yeah. tour, all that. Future is always on tour. But it still comes, it still comes down to you Why'd having you to sign that? off on a day. Yeah. And right. you signed off on a day that you knew you was going to be in fucking Europe or something. Like, that's stupid. That's stupid. That's, that's stupid. You shouldn't know you should have. You, you shouldn't, you shouldn't schedule something for your mouth. son yeah. I, for your son for your child and I, what i don't know how i don't know if he has other kids you got, got like 12 like, other yeah, kids got hella fucking so kids. and there's and then that that probably plays a factor into it as well cuz we again we only know so based much, off of yeah. this off of this post we don't know how how many visits they actually had how many he actually missed none of that we just know the percentages that was put on there so he may have to divvy up his time between the 11 other kids that he has plus the tour plus the other thing while Sierra only has three kids and she's a stay at home mom so mm. I understand what it you're saying it still boils down to you, you picking you, a date you, you p- but since damn you well picked a date on tour no, I Europe. definitely agree with y'all yeah, you pick those days and you know those days like uh, uh, right. ahead of time it's, it's that, you that's need the to part. be there my nigga you, that's the part that's the part that, you need that's, to be there. that switches it hmm. well, if you schedule if you schedule that shit then you need to be there. Like, but I just seen the comment that just said, "But if Future wasn't able to make money for his kids, y'all will also talk about him. Make y'all mind. Y'all will shame him for that too. Make y'all mind up. No, no. there's all. He's, he's, got, he's, no. Him money missing is, one concert not gonna stop his bag. Exactly. Not at all. Future, not at all. future. And if we and if we talking about general, niggas are really money. Talk, like, if we talking about torn. general, like a general, like a regular ass human that being, then no, there's jo- plenty of jobs out there. Like oh. I'm not, I'm not putting, the, I'm not putting my son behind no fucking money. I'm so, sorry. So I, I, I get I that point, not, but that is that is my flesh and blood. So I'm obligated. I'm responsible to take care of. So, so let's so let's like, take it off of off of future and Sierra. Let's bring it down to like regular people. Working I was just about to say that nine to five jobs. So say I get say I work say I work Monday through Friday. Get my kids on the weekend. Say mm-hmm. I get scheduled on that weekend two to three times out the month. 
Uh-huh. Do I, am I still a bad dad because I have to go to work on those days of the week because I don't pick my child over that money that I need to pay that child support and et cetera, et cetera? The Dude, difference is, again. Again, but like again, if lost. it's if it's scheduled, if y'all scheduled scheduled it, you need to tell but your employer. I can't employer, control that though. Nope, yeah. I can't you control can. that. You I, can, no, you can't. Though. I can't control that. Yes, you I can't can. control that. Yes, you can. If I tell my if I tell my employer that. I won't be no, will no longer be working on Sundays, I won't be I'll be I won't be working on Sundays. You said what? If I tell my employer I cannot work on Sundays, but if it's a mandatory, he, you got to work three days out the I mean three weekends out the year or three three weekends out the month. Make sure that that should be. Schedule. That's schedule. You still got to you know you know. go through the other parent. But if like, it's on hey, those days, but I'm saying if it's on those days, am I still a shitty dad for that? It's, that's still no, some days I'm missing. He's not no, a shitty dad. Because unless, like you, unless you communicated that, then there's no problem with that. And it's but not, like, one sole situation like doesn't make you a shitty dad. It's exactly. that over 100% a hundred percent of your business, you've thing. missed sixty three percent. He missed thirty five percent. Thirty five. You missed thirty five of them. You missed a third of the hundred percent that you're supposed to get. No matter how much money you make or where you're working at, that's wrong. That's what's wrong. The fact that you missed it and we scheduled it. That's what's wrong. It don't matter if he's rich, if he's poor. You missed your scheduled visit. But not everybody got the luxury to quit their job and get missed out on and work. And then, and then also, saying, no, work with your If you know that you got to work this weekend, they tell you a month. They, mo- people don't just give you shit the week of. Most jobs, of. good jobs don't give you shit the week of, day of, none of that. They give you shit a month yeah, in advance. Way, but I'm way. saying that. So if you know a month in advance you got to work on Saturday and Sunday, tell your baby mama, hey, this Saturday and Sunday, I can't still a get a schedule visit you missed. That's still, you still miss that schedule visit. Regardless if you call her and told her, hey, I, I missed it. I know. I can't come. But it's you still miss that visit. Yeah. But you still miss that visit. It doesn't matter if you We don't know. I'm saying, but we don't know what future could it We don't know those if it's rescheduled or not. We can take it at face value. We don't know none of that shit. And we don't know what exactly why. He missed them. Uh, That's my point. We I don't just, know why exactly he missed what he missed. And, and I, but I just feel like, I mean, I don't know if this is what happened. But if you um, if you knew that you was gonna be on tour or whatever the fuck the case may be, my nigga, Everything, don't don't I feel like don't every, agree to that day. Too much of our lives are planned out for you not to know that you're not gonna be there. It's not the fa- it's the fact that you missed it. We don't. Well, it's, again, like you're saying. And God forbid the motherfuckers was like on set days of the week. So like you was coming. <laughs> yeah, that's a whole different thing. You know, this you Wednesday you just didn't come. Like yeah, yeah. See, it's see, like that's, that. that's, but, that, but the not thing just it showing tie, up it ties doesn't make, make you a bad dad. Yeah, so and not it, showing it, up makes you a bad dad. It, it it depends on the consi- if it's com- communication. Con- that's I don't, it. Right there. One, I mean, I don't it's think one small incident makes like, somebody a bad. Okay, dad, it also yeah, depends. Yeah. It also it and com- a lot of up. shit. A lot of shit ties in for somebody because of their bad parent. It's all about their attitude towards yeah, it's that not child. Just so it's like mm. not a. It's you, consistency. Like, you can, it's like, consistency. You can come. You can come being. You can come. You can miss a every uh, scheduled meeting. Like you can be there every single time. But you can just be there and just sitting there, and the kids just up, with yeah, a fucked up attitude, yeah. just not giving a fuck, kid running around, and, that and all that. And that make you more just, of a shitty parent than you. Missing you just doing, you, know what I'm you that, just doing it because. Because you got to. Because you, you, you got to. Yeah. But I'm yeah. saying that we can't. I don't think we can really say futures a shitty. That I mean, because I see a lot of people we're saying futures. No, I'm not saying. Not, right. I'm not saying we are. I'm saying people in general are in comments. I see people say futures a shitty dad because he missed that time or he didn't get that time. You dig what I'm saying? Plus just like you just things. said, that one moment or those few moments don't make you a shitty dad. It's your overall performance. You, your overall performance yeah. how you deal with that kid as a, you know what I'm saying, as, as a, a parent. Whole. True. As a whole. It's not that 35% you fucked up. The 35% of visits that you missed. I don't think exactly. those should factor if, into I, I feel him like being a you, bit, I don't a think that should dad. make him a bad dad. But it, it does make I feel it, like make if he genuinely did everything yeah, he did, that he could do. To say, hey, like, if you did everything that you could have possibly done to make it there and you still couldn't make it there, that's then, different. but if you did not but put in the 100%, let me, let the me ask you a question if you did not put in the 100% effort that you could to spend that time with your kid, I'm then not fucking with it, baby. Let me ask y'all a quick okay. question real quick. So what if, he, what if he missed any of those appointments because he was tending to one of his 11 other kids? 11. I don't fl- 11. No, nah, I still feel like that's right. wrong. Why not have the kids together? Yeah. yeah. Why not have the kids? Because they Bring all the kids got with you. they all got different, different mamas and, and shit. Different and y'all know how that shit go. And y'all know how that shit go. When yeah. a nigga yeah, got three, right. four different baby mamas, right. right. and then it's future. But we all right. know future ain't shit. Like he, <laughs> he do he be four bitches bad. <laughs> oh God. So it's like I give you that true. So it's like so what if he missed that shit because like he was busy tending to one of his other kids? But it but it was already scheduled. It was already scheduled, but. Your, your kids could call you. Down. Your it kids down to communication. Your kids really. could call you. It does. It call does. You, but I'm it, saying yeah. your kids could call you with anything, and it's like 
Shit, like we should get into some of these comments definitely. on here. Definitely, because they've been getting into. I've been seeing a lot of them. I've been seeing a lot of them pop up too. Let me go back up to the top. Like, uh, comment, share. We at BLE Studios, man. It's Popular Ignorance episode twelve thirteen. I don't fucking know. Ron Chase, yo, man, where the fuck you come from, nigga? I never seen you walk in this motherfucker. Ron Chase, man, me and this motherfucker, man. What's going on, girly? Ron Chase said, "I'm beating the fuck out of said friend." Um, when we was talking about pressing for sex, yeah. Uh, the ones that go for the low be some mid. What are you talking about? They coochies be some mid. Or they they dicks be some mid. I'm telling the police if you raping motherfuckers, nah, you need to have a seat behind bars. I think with that comes a lot of responsibility. Um, when you go to the police, you have to have some type of evidence, especially in a rape case, or I'm they sorry, don't I'm sorry, I don't mean to interrupt you. you. Can, you can you repeat our, uh, our statement again? I'm please? telling the police if you raping motherfuckers, nah, you need to have nah, you need to have a seat behind bars. I definitely feel like that, but I also feel like you got to get that victim I ain't to never go along to with you. Because sometimes it's it's it's, 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 a lot it's not as easy. It's like it. yeah. it's it's a, it's a lot of variables and a lot of situations that go in. I mean, a lot of bullshit that goes into because it. Because they probably look at it like if you're not in the situation, like if the victim is not complaining, you Why can't. Why are you talking about it? You can't say that. Even that, like that's wrong, that. but that's how they that's how yeah. they and look it. And, and if you don't have no evidence, then they really yeah, don't then they really don't. They yeah, because that's with it. that shit scars. That that that's, shit really fucks people. Fucks people yeah. up. I know a lot of people. You have to females, mentally be ready I, to I, go I, through that shit. Like you have to mentally yes. be ready to talk about that it. Shit. Yeah. You got to be ready to. That's contain, all. Like relive yeah. the situation yeah. consistently. They're gonna ask you a thousand personal personal questions. They have shit to do while you was raped. Nothing. And then you gotta you gotta wanna talk or they're gonna be like, Well, you don't wanna tell us this, so you might be lying. Like, like they don't there, wanna There's hear that. nothing that that you can do to make a motherfucker rape you besides that motherfucker being a rapist. It don't matter what you wear. It don't matter what you wear. It don't matter how you were acting. Yeah, none of that. Don't, don't I don't want to hear she had on the short was, shorts. Yeah, none yeah, of that. Just having this conversation yeah, yeah. She was acting like she wanted to fuck. I don't know. She did not say she wanted to fuck. She said no, no, me. Remember when we was outside in the car having that conversation? She said no. The girl said no. That's it. That's it. That's all. Or she said stop. No, stop. my dick went from this to the gonzo nose. Right. <laughs> uh, no, I mean, uh, gummy worm. worm. That mug that mug that went back saying? to gummy worm. Yeah. I'm sorry, go ahead with the comments, Corey. It's like once you tell me stop, bro, that's it. Like, yeah. I don't care. Stop. Uh, Baby said, I'm done. He said, I'm once done. she said stop, See, I'm, I'm, done. Done. I'm, I'm, like this. I'm not touching her you no more. You can't say stop, you gotta say hold on. Give me a second. Yeah, say hold on. Stop. Stop. Like, stop. If you if you say Please. if you say any, if you say anything insinu- insinuating, stop, or anything inciting that you don't want to keep having sex, we won't continue. What if you sex? like really pound her shit? She just need to hold on. Wait, give me a second. Say like nope. you said. Say hold on. No, just take that shit. Nope, I'm not. I'm stopping. <laughs> <laughs> wait, say just take that shit. Yeah, like this. Like, shut up. I can't get a. Hold on. Tell the bitch, shut up. You about to fuck with another. Oh, yeah, like, be quiet. Well, bitch. No, I'll stopping. let you stop. I'll let fuck you want me to stop. No, no, I'm stopping. <laughs> that's sick, fuck bro. Because that. females are scandalous, bro. They are sca- they, they scandalous. Say that one more time. Females say that one more time because a, wicked, bro. a females. bitch wicked. will do that. that I, think, I think wicked I like is like the perfect word. Perfect that word. That is a perfect word. To describe yeah. wicked, that. Wicked. It's wicked to bitches. Yeah. To describe that, that is. Because bitches rape literally, itself is wicked. Literally will act like they was against it the whole time. No, bitch. Hold on, wait. And just, we had and an agreement. Exactly. And you and changed then, your mind. What? And, that, and when you You're get mad when you get, when you get that label under you you. When you no, get, no, ma'am. You mad because people found out we fucked, and now you want to say I raped you? That's, yeah. When you, that's and when you get that, when you get that label, that 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 follows along. Follows so you forever. It follows you. Yeah. You get that label. Regardless, like, oh, this shit ain't never going away. Yeah. That shit. That shit don't ever go away. I mean, they think OJ might have killed a white bitch. And they all get dead. Any label, any any label, label you get, like, and it, and it doesn't matter <laughs> just the outside. Any ch- like any type of like charge or whatever, that's just gonna follow you along. People's gonna bring that innocent. up and be like, oh, you did. And then this people will use that shit as a joke. Even if you're innocent, they will use that shit against you, nigga. But you, but niggas is out here calling you right. Like, if you in that, like, that's fucked up. I mean, Antonio like, Brown's look, a perfect example. Look, 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 look at the shit that happened to my nigga Kobe. Like, the shit happened what, back in like 2005. Uh, Gail and shit when she brought. Funky right, dog that, head bitch. Right. Yeah, so the, the, the shit happened like back in like 2004 or five, whatever, whatever, whatever the Next case may facts. be. I highly, me personally, I don't think Kobe did it. I think the bitch she seen a a, a, a fucking know. rich black, a rich, a rich black basketball player. Rich black she was MVP like, she let me hop on that motherfucker. And, and then boom, she start trying to get money out of. Too. That's right. what I think. But my point is like years down the line, after my nigga, well, when my nigga die, they still bring that shit up. Like right. in his time of death. Yeah. So it's like, like you said, that shit don't ever, that shit never leaves, never, never leave. going away, never. 
And people be ruthless with the shit. They don't give a fuck how it makes you feel. They don't give a fuck what you're going through. They don't give a fuck if you was innocent or not. Nick, motherfuckers are ruthless. And that's, Hell, that's, and that's the worst. And that is the, the worst of the worst. The, uh, like, one movie that, uh, or the series that came out on Netflix <laughs> about the the guys, the Central Park Five. Yeah. Mm-hmm. They said rap, when they said they raped the, 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 the white girl, and raped that white woman, and, and gave Autumn. We're not gonna talk about that. I feel like we get a little deep into this, y'all. Let's let Quay slide into our next. Uh, to, they, yeah, facts. Let Quay slide into our next topic, man. We are getting a little too deep into wait, this wait, right wait, now. Wait, wait, wait. Some of these comments is kind juicy. Of yeah, they juicy. Uh, read them. Read them to me. Taylor said, "Hell no, nah, I can never respect anyone that doesn't take care of their kids." Thank you. Um, facts. If Future um, did say that publicly, he would be a simp. What did he say? If he said what publicly? I think she was saying something to what we said. Um, Rache said, "How the fuck you missed the days that you that you picked?" Facts. That's right. That's, the what facts. I that's, that's, that's all I was saying. The I got that, I got that point. Right. Right. Um, um, but if Future wasn't able to make, okay, we read that comment. Mm-hmm. Um. I've quit jobs behind them expecting me to put a job before my kid. I've, Facts. And there's been plenty of times where people have Facts. had money who said comes that? And, money who comes said and go. That? Money comes and yeah. go. I don't, I don't, I don't, you can always Rashi make did. money. You I can always Rashi make Rashi money. I get it. Of course you can always Facts. make money. But I'm saying not everybody's in the, in the financial position state, to be able to just quit a job. To just quit a job. and Because you don't know what everybody's situation is. You don't know if they're living check to check, bill to bill. You don't know, but they, they gotta always, find another. So if I gotta first. miss my kid for that weekend, gets to be able to put a roof over their head. I miss that. But listen, listen, listen. Not even. Not even. Not even. serious, but you don't. Every day is not promised. What if something happened to your kids and That's you missed it for work? Say. I did what if, that. What if, I, what if, I swear what to God, what if I didn't quit jobs because they didn't told me. Well, like they, I don't have nobody to watch my son. No, it's nobody but me to watch my son. Like. You just not gonna leave your son. They don't give a damn. I can go apply for another job. I can not go apply for another motherfucking kid. Right. Right. That's why. Like, like, like he might literally need me for that day, and I'm not finna. Oh well, I gotta go to work, or I'm gonna miss my. I'm gonna go apply to the next motherfucking job, and I'm gonna dug the fuck out until until I figure it out. Like maybe it's just because I'm a mama, but that's just how it should be for mothers and fathers. That's just like. Period. That's like if you're at work and you get an emergency saying your kid's heading to the hospital. What are you going to do? Are you going to stay there? Are you gonna and go jobs will literally be like, well, you can't leave. I'm going to leave. I'm going to leave, though. Going, I'm you going, can't leave. I'm but clocking I'm out, if, baby. But you, if, even though I knew the risk, if, on, there's, some, some, there's some bosses out there well, that be this. like, if you leave, you get fired. That's different. Well, watch this. We're talking about a different ball game. It's not really because you... In a way, it is because you're talking about my kid's welfare. It don't matter. You're talking about my kid's welfare over a bag. My kids, what? Like, Yo, you, like you just said, you can never make another kid. You I can't feel make, like you can't your make kids should come before your, anything. Your kids' period. welfare is a twenty-four. But I'm thing. saying, you but, you're you're about but your child should come before anything. Bags, exactly. period. It, whether they're, so whether they're, they're not that's well or whether they're that. well or and not. How am I not putting my kid above all if I'm going to get this bag for my kid? Because, because you can get money, another money, bag. Money ain't everything. You can get another bag. Him being on tour is not him missing one. I'm not talking about future no more. I'm not talking about future. Oh, well, in general, general. general. you can get another bag. You can't get another bag. I don't care how you get your bag. You can get another bag. You can't get another baby. I'm not saying money should be your first priority. It's gonna be sad. But if that's that's more so, I think you're talking more so if you're like a single parent. If yeah, you're talking about single, single parents, parents then that's then yeah. different. That's a totally different. That's exactly what I'm talking about. Single a lot of the times yeah. with single mothers and single fathers, with them growing up, they miss a lot of shit. Yeah. Now, if you're a single parent, that's totally different. If you are a, if you're not a single parent and you have somebody working there with you, then you need to be able to communicate with that person you have if that you child have with. No to to like, if you have no other option, like if you have no other option, then to sacrifice that time, then then it's understandable. But if you have an option and you choose to sacrifice your time. Then it's a why why would you not like if you if you can make it but you just have other options and you choose one of those options over, over your, your son kid, yeah, this, then or your kid that is a wrap yeah, because you you up. that your child should be your first priority mm-hmm. your you child have, I, your, like, your child period. should come first period anything like, unless you I, just when I see them post- you're, unless you're a single parent and you have to make that sacrifice and I feel well, like I feel like parents that that it's make that good. sacrifice. They do it for their kid. Like yeah. a lot of a lot of kids. And be hurt and you, be hurting the whole time. Kid, yeah, oh trust me. Like, yeah, yeah, yeah. like you you gonna struggle. Like, I mean, it raising a kid is hard to do whether it's only one parent or two parents. It's harder as a single parent. Yeah. Because you gotta put in it's more all effort. You, you gotta not, play yeah. both sides. Yeah. And nine times out of ten, if you're unwilling to make that, like if you don't wanna make that sacrifice and you just have to, like, it be the parents that that 
that they don't come the parents that actually have to make that sacrifice and they don't have another choice they don't complain it'd be the ones trying to make excuses and they, exactly. they could do it but they chose not to do it and they like make an excuse well i had to go to work no you Jim wanted Perry, to put right? that over your child but you but you had a choice like you could have made some shit work i know motherfuckers that got like full-time you gonna, jobs, full-time you're gonna you're gonna struggle classes, regardless. That. right right but it's 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 always it's always gonna you're always gonna come out on top. There's money gone always. Oh, there's, God. Either, I'm gonna either say you're this not is, working I it for yourself, there's it. always gonna be somebody out there that loves you and is gonna be like, Hey, I'm not gonna let you struggle. Oh God. Like, and, there's and always gonna be listen, there's, there's thug ways it, around and it. I can't stress it enough. Thug it the fuck out, baby. Thug that shit out. Cause you, you can get another bag. Like it's, there's, it's not money, there's, money, there's, money, there's, money there's plenty money of resources like, for you to get help too. So it's just like, don't think like, oh fuck, I fucked up my bag because my kid. No, it's everything love, comes in welfare, goes. Welfare, like, section eight, food stamps, mm-hmm. all that, that, all, 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 that, that all that shit. I get so that. it's I like, get yeah, you may struggle, but in due time, you're gonna get you're gonna get gonna back get to where you was at. Yeah. But don't ever put your don't ever put your kid second to anything. Anything. Your because other your other partner your other partner your mama Easily all replaced. all that like that my kid coming first uh, out in, front of of, in front of in front of everybody oh, boy, every right everybody you know, everything like, whenever I be seeing like like for example um Steph and Aisha Curry bro they, goals they, as fuck bro they put they put they say that they put. Ew, I said goals as fuck. They I'm put sorry. each other. You think so? You couldn't out, huh? I'm you couldn't help yourself. myself. I'm sorry. Go ahead. I'm feeling, you I'm think they so? They put each I other before. My, I wish the fuck my bitch would, but anyway. Um, what you, wait, they, wait, 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 wait. What you mean? Be um. Oh, that one, that one thing. But she uh about the attention. Yeah. Oh, <laughs> I know. Wait, wait, wait. wait, wait, wait. Divorce, but um. What she say? <laughs> oh, different shit. topic, bro. But, okay, well, basically, what she well, I, I sum it up for you real quick. She was just on a fucking talk show, sad as fuck because she, she, didn't was, get she don't get attention from other niggas because she's playing and she's married. You see what I be saying? Y'all she see said, what I be she saying? She said, she said, it just don't make her feel y'all see what I be beautiful saying? enough, I guess. Do y'all see what I be saying? <laughs> she dead ass at that? Oh, no, she was, she was dead ass, bro. She wasn't playing. And Jada Pickett and all of them was on there. Go ahead, sad go ahead, not, But anyway, go ahead. But anyway go ahead. like I was saying, um, speak that shit, another no, day, bro. <laughs> but anyway, um, but anyway, uh, they yeah. said that they put each other, and I get that they're actually, they're full-fledged married, but just me personally, and y'all know how I feel about marriage, but uh-huh. me personally, I couldn't, but they said they put each other before their own their own kids. Like they said, they said that's 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 what they do. Like I think me them, personally, I think I think I, with them what I they meant is that because with if y'all are in a bad relationship or if y'all had a bad relationship with each other, then it it can trickle down to your kids. So maybe that's what they meant in a sense. Definitely, if you have like a good solid relationship with your partner, then you it, can it be makes, better your, for your, your child's gonna that's, grow up. That's what they were saying. Yeah. That's okay. exactly what they were saying. But it was worded the wrong way. No, no, that's, that, that's pretty much exactly what they said. But okay. me personally, you don't I just feel like because this, this is the thing. Because this is the thing. Happiness mm-hmm. comes from yourself. It don't come from your spouse. Facts. So therefore, I need to have a strong facts. foundation. Y- y- y'all need to be. Y'all need to be happy. With individually, y'all, with yeah. yourselves first, yeah. you know what I'm saying. As far as a kid, kids don't, kids don't. You have more. I can't wrap my head around over like, their, their happiness. happiness over their I'm happiness. True. Like, they like, like that material is things. That is like they like little, what like, they see. little, little shit. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Like what they see in a way. Because yeah. right. like, like, bills don't make them happy. Paying exactly. bills don't make yeah, them happy. Yeah, they don't know. They don't know if you pay the bills or not. But they know if you showed up. As far as they're concerned, last time or a couple times. As far as they're concerned, those lights are supposed to come on. Right. When they give a damn how many Jordan pair of Jordan shoes that you bought, they're gonna take them off the school and run them into the fucking car. They're taking them motherfuckers off in the car on the way to the destination, baby. They don't care. And when they walk up to that light, they expect the light to come on. They're not going to flick on the light and expect it. Not to come on, they were like, What the fuck? And if it don't come on, they don't think the shit's broke. They're not they're, gonna say, they're gonna My mama didn't pay the bill, right? I exactly. I want to say one thing real quick before we get to our next topic. What's up? Fuck them kids. Sorry. Oh, oh my god, god. <laughs> you, put your, for your, you put your wife. No, I'm really just talking shit. We already had that conversation. Y'all really just talking shit. Don't say the person. I thought you was finna say, Fuck Keisha Cole. That's what I thought. Nah, I love kids like that. Nah, go into our next topic. Say, Fuck Keisha Cole. No, I heard a pussy real, stink. Though. Whole different conversation for a whole different whole day. Different I heard Megan Thee Stallion coochie stink. <gasps> oh, my God. It don't God. stink. What about Rihanna? She good? Rihanna looks like her coochie smell just smell so like... Smell like what? Roses and strawberries, huh? Some bullshit. She smells like she smells sweet. Don't she got some shit, though? Who? Rihanna. Not That was back then. Back then? You know that. You know they been and got that clear shit. She cleared by now. You know what I'm saying? Oh. The reason why Chris Brown beat her ass. Chlamydia? Yeah. Ah, 
Well, hopefully she got that cleared up, man. I don't, yeah, I don't want to see my nigga that cleared up. It's been about 12 years. I hope you ain't still walking around with that, with that shit. shit. Like, oh. Scratching and shit. That's why she dancing like this. Oh, don't, do that. <laughs> don't do that. Don't do that. Don't do that. Don't do that. She's trying to scratch that shit. Let me see it. It was worth 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 it. Stop it. Stop it. It was worth it. It was worth it. It was worth it. Stop it. Stop it. That's my bitch. What can she do? She said some bullshit about. Nah, 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 she ain't say nothing about Chief Keef. They, no, they were saying fuck Chief Keef, and they called him Keisha Cole. Oh. That's, why, that's where the shit came from. He was like, oh, fuck Keisha Cole. Yeah. He, was talking about, he, was talking, he was talking about Chief Keef, but he was calling him a bitch. That's what he was doing. Oh. <laughs> Gotcha. Just like if a um. Right. <laughs> oh, like the, like how they be fucking up uh uh Regine's name, Roger. Little refrigerator. Yeah, they call her different shit yeah. instead of calling little her name. That's funny as fuck. Yeah. Little oh, Regine. Yeah, little Wayne daughter. Yeah, yeah. Resume. 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 I seen that. Shit. Don't <laughs> Regina. <laughs> they called her refrigerator. <laughs> The, the, the resume, Retracted. that's the one that took me yes. out. Boy, I was dead Republican, as fuck. Okay. <laughs> Sounds like next topic, man. All right, last right. popular ignorance topic. You know, it's going to skew a little bit. Before we get to motherfucking brick house, you dig know what I'm saying? Yeah, matter of fact, make sure that y'all text us at our number. 816-622-2256. Make sure y'all We'll get somebody over to you. Just wait. We will. So uh, make dead sure y'all text homie. us because we'll answer all your questions, all that good shit. Get exactly. ignorant if y'all want ma- to. And make sure y'all actually text Brickhouse, because y'all don't hit me and D-Lo up for shit. Oh, God. Y'all be in the oh, comments and bullshit. Uh, I thought, fuck that clip happened last week. Oh, you know God. how many inboxes I got about that clip? Boy. Uh, you know how many ask me? Do you, you know how many FaceTime your... calls I got? Like, first of all, first of all, it was your knees, baby. It wasn't the no, I'm I got a few. I got a few compliments about my knees. They said, "Oh, I'm finna tap." Oh. They said, I'm finna tap They said, got some strong ass legs." Oh, when they oh. said this show was the D's knees, bro, I couldn't, bro. <laughs> the best thing, oh, baby. They said, I couldn't. Fuck, it's a D's knees. They said, they said you had Meg knees. That's disrespectful. Yo, my yeah. shit is. I got really strong legs for no good reason, y'all. Because fuck y'all. But it's just the but fact just, that you had on them ankle daddies, boy. That, <laughs> that to piggyback off of. What y'all was talking about last month? I mean, last, last month, last week. You was actually asking a question about getting pegged or whatever. Yeah, that's that's the, that's the original that question. That was a real question. That, that was a real question. That was the original but question. But not about that had them getting like pegged. That. But like it was more or less like it was, it was saying that anal sex is unisex. unisex. It's oh, not, that yeah. weird ass shit. Yeah. Do y'all think unisex is un? I mean, anal sex is unisex. No, I, I, dis- no. I, I disagree. I'm not it's, fucking my nigga. As far as, <laughs> no. as far as, as far as, I disagree. What? I disagree that it's unisex. I don't. Oh. I don't think so because because I'm I don't feel like penetration is meant for males. Like it's not what? meant. No, I'm saying I don't that think she's saying she's it's not, not meant for meant y'all. Oh, it's like it's not meant for y'all. Meant y'all meant y'all penetration. What? You know what I'm saying? Y'all are meant to penetrate, not to be penetrated. Thank you. I'm on your y'all sure. side. Quit looking at me sideways, baby. I can suck my ass lick. <laughs> that's not penetration, so that's okay. That. I felt that. Yeah. Yeah. I'm talking like my ass lick. It's, it's like, it's like penetration. penetration with the tongue out on mine. <laughs> <laughs> bitch, no you tips us in the salad, please. Please. <laughs> not just please. Like that. It's no you tips us in the salad. It's like you feel it in your legs, bro. Oh. Bro, what you say last week that shit gets you? be like, oh, shit. <laughs> that's why I felt with, um, well, uh, yeah, and Lil Boat was like, she was like, <laughs> <laughs> with, with, uh, with, I can't say no, his name because he got a girlfriend stop, now. Stop, 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 stop. We're being messy, stop. We get in the break house, fuck that. I always yeah. want to talk. No, 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 y'all ain't gonna talk to me. No. It's a, it's a, well, how, how do y'all feel about, about anal? Lit. It's lit. If you lick this motherfucker, I ain't gonna be mad no. at you. You got to lick it. How do you, how do you feel? Before you stick it. Ain't no sticking anal. Ain't no sticking anal. How do you feel about anal? No, put it in, in the in the and you, not, you putting it in her. Yeah, we're not talking about that shit. We're talking about traditional anal sex. Oh, yeah, that shit, that shit's up. It's, it's lit, bro. It's up. I think. It's, let's speak it's, from it's a messy. From a woman's perspective, how do y'all feel about like, that? Okay. I don't have a problem trying it, but I would have to, like, go through it. And some, please comment. Or, do y'all, do y'all want me to get shit. into details and y'all want me to just give them? Yeah, go ahead. Please. We like details. We even like names if you can give them. Listen, okay, let me say, if you got to have that mother... Where's your bottle? Let me see your bottle. You got gotta you. have that motherfucker. I'm talking about. Don't think you finna from the jump. And don't, I personally, don't put it in there unless we about to be done. Because I don't want you to put it, it back me. in your I don't coochie, want it yeah. back in my coochie. <laughs> <laughs> I'm clean, but that's like nigga said 
so like, you get the wrong. Yeah, it's just the wrong. Right. You mix it too many the juices. Yeah, I get, I get, you, you know what I'm saying? Like, it just to cross me cross contamination. You can get it. You can catch it. You can get infection from that. That's it, baby. Cross contamination. I don't want that. That's like putting the the tub or the toilet rag on the tub. Like don't do that. Yeah, just for both. The cherry on top. You know what I'm saying? But don't think you finna. Oh God, when you better be done. Just we're done, baby. Listen, once you hear this. I'm on that mother. Eh, eh, eh. Once you try to go back, no, but that motherfucker do gotta be wrong ho. If, no if you ain't got that motherfucker, ain't no wrong ho. Macaroni, yeah. no, don't macaroni, do it. cause that shit. So should he hang it, it, before it, he it, stick it? It definitely is like a time for that shit. Should he lick it before he stick? Yeah, it? he he need to do all that. <laughs> do all that, baby. Like I said, once you hear <laughs> do all that. You know what time it is? Cause if you don't, it might be a little painful. And make sure it, it gotta be, you know what I'm saying? The juice gotta be running from the rooter to the tutor. So it's, like, it's, a time, it's a time for that shit. It you can't do it every time, time you try to fuck your bitch. Like it is a time, and y'all both gotta be on one accord. Don't just, don't just, you can't. All you gotta do is say the magical words. Put it in my ass. I got you. Don't say less. <laughs> and right. you can't put it in there as fast as you put it in the pussy. You, 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 you got to ease into that. Talk like, me into the it. Slowest process on God's green earth. You gotta, you gotta, you gotta. This, this is how you do it. Talk to him nice. Talk to me quick. Don't talk to me slow. Um, so like she said, you definitely, you got to beat the pause up for like at least like a, a while, bro. What'd you say? Say that again? The pause. You know, no, repeat, repeat the whole sentence. You got to beat, beat the, the pause up. You know oh. what I'm saying? <laughs> you got to be, you got to be in that motherfucker for a cool little minute. And then, you know, them yes. juices got to get back there. Facts. And then Certainly. after that, you know. Yes. Off the muscle, off the arm, you going to probably stick a little thumb in there. You know what I'm saying? Off the muscle. Oh, but middle you, finger. Thank you. Something. Something. Get some get ready. But that's what you got to do. Ease me into that. Yeah, you got to. Because. It's it's an asshole, bro. So it's you can't go punching. It's hot. Fuck. It's really not meant to be like penetrated. It's but not. It's not. It's not meant for that. It so is it's be looking no, at no, it's really say not. Say it again. Say the it way, again. The way, the way, the way, the way, because he's trying to disagree. Say it one more time, like baby. The, it, it's not. It's meant. not meant for that. Thank you. But the way it look, the way it look at you sometimes. <laughs> Just can't, can't. <laughs> I'm saying, it's like, be so cute, like you want me to go in there. It's like we're not saying it's wrong to do so. We just saying that the original. What the nigga say? What the nigga, uh, uh they, they say? They, not the camera fool. He is in the camera. Oh, well, I don't know he what's going on. It's slow, my nigga. Fuck it. Anywho. <laughs> what is he doing with his mouth? I don't fucking know, yo. He's getting <laughs> sick, yo. He's thinking about eating ass right now. Nah, man, but I just really feel like, you know, don't try ain't nothing until like y'all have done everything else on the fucking board. You dig what I'm saying? Just leave it off now. Don't just go in there like, hey, baby, I'm about to stick it in your ass tonight. It's, so mm-hmm. it's not, don't do all that. I know the popular ignorance thing. What, fuck it, it's all right. It's about okay, to... baby. It's all right. Come back. It's okay. <laughs> y'all, y'all ain't just hear that? Hear what? Maybe I'm geeking. You geeking. I, I, I heard somebody behind me, but. Look at Look at you. Look at you. Oh, and number, the second question on here. We already asked. I already asked. But he's not gonna tell the us. The way it looks at you. <laughs> the freakiest thing that y'all have ever done. I'm going last. Eight. I'm going last. You got my ass. Eight. Got my ass. Eight. That's the freakiest thing I've ever done. It feels so good. I almost love cried. it. I almost I cried when it happened. Why? Tear. Love I had it. that Denzel glory tear. Like, oh my god, bitch. Love it. I never I'm thought amazing. I would. You know what I'm saying? My nigga never. B. Shout out to my nigga B. Oh, let shout me, out to Brian, bro. Let me tell y'all. Shout out to Brandon. You know what I'm saying? Let me, <laughs> Why let me tell y'all real quick, and his story is pretty much the same exact way. So facts. I'm like 19, 19 at the time as well. My nigga be like 26. <laughs> yeah, facts. We in traffic. <laughs> Shit. We in traffic. Gets getting off work, going home. We in traffic. We was all the way down there by fucking the, the airport and shit. We were on Front oh. Street. <laughs> he telling me like, man, the girl who did that shit, man, I could never give her up. Did you know what I'm saying? I'm like, fuck you, me. You can't never give her up because I know me like it's, I'm quick to free a bitch. Uh-huh. So I'm like, nigga. Fuck you, mean you can't give her up, nigga. What? I'm thinking, I'm th- I'm trying to play him like a ham now. You're a burger. <laughs> Gotta be. He like, bro, I just can't, bro. Ooh, I just can't. Ooh, this and that. So I'm like, bro, I don't know about all that shit, bro. Like, I, I just don't think I'm cool with all that. You did? It sounded like, what? You did who? Fast forward a know. few years. It's this the shit, shit that, that will fuck with <laughs> your brain, boy. It's the shit that will drive you insane. And, and the reason why we say that, bro, because, like, you a dead-ass start liking this bitch, It just feels amazing. Like, you just a dead-ass start feeling like you feel like you can't even bitch, treat you that her nasty. no I'm type really of way. No. Bitch, you that nasty. nasty. You can't even treat her like none of your other hoes no more. You, you on a whole different Because she ain't, because your other hoes ain't doing it. You're not like, doing that kind of thing. Your other hoes ain't doing it. They're right here. She right here. Yo, yeah, you up here with it now. If you, because you on. You, you on that? You on that. 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 You
I can tell y'all who the real throat goat is. Because a lot of these bitches be claiming that shit. Y'all don't really go is, yo. y'all don't, don't, don't say you a throat goat if you ain't own that. Really you know what I'm saying? I don't want to hear no more of that shit, bro. If y'all ain't own it. You can't be the throat goat if you don't eat ass. Facts. That's what I said. No, everything else I do is just throat goat. It's not. It's not obsolete. I ain't saying everything Everything else you do is obsolete. But um. But you don't really use your throat. Just don't talk all that super big boy sheep. Just don't talk all that super that super woman that that. That, that super around. freaky that I want to hear not none of that shit if you ain't on that bro you, I want to hear nothing you can't nothing. be a you damn near y- yeah yeah yes yes because it's clean <laughs> not. it's a booty hole mm. well of course he do <laughs> because it's he get on Facebook here. and he tell them girls he gonna booty lick that booty hey, hole is that really what I say on Facebook do yeah. I really say do I really tell y'all that I'm gonna lick y'all booty hole I want to hear the nasty you don't say you don't say that you don't lick that booty hole you just be like. I feel like licking some ass today. <laughs> I don't do that. Yes, the fuck you. Do. I don't do that. <laughs> I don't hear nastiest thing you ever done because you met some white woman before. So I know that was like I mean, freaky diggy. I haven't really done it. I, not that I can think of. You ain't never licked no you booty? Fucked somebody baby mama. I feel like that's pretty sick. You put a th- yeah, thumb in that's, 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 that's probably the most uh, I'm fuck somebody's baby mama. I still can't even get my pregnant shot. Yeah, pregnant. No, that's exactly what the fuck you did. Fucking pregnant pussy. That's the nastiest shit. Some freaky ass shit. While her son was kicking, huh? <laughs> sick. <laughs> <laughs> eye Big contact facts. though, y'all sick. Con- everything. Sick. My question, I, I, cause I'm really, Shooting up the I'm club really over here. <laughs> what's the what's the nastiest thing? You- I mean, I think I know. I think I know. <laughs> what? <laughs> <laughs> no, I, I I haven't done that. What's so. the nastiest thing you've done, Quay? Uh, but y'all said nobody's yeah, no, nasty until cool. they do that. So okay, it's like, I said you want to throw goat to you. Um, no, nah, I'm saying it. No, I'm saying serious. it. I'm saying it, but you ain't nasty if you ain't on it. But I'm going to keep it a band. And they ain't got to be. You ain't got I tell people all the time. You ain't got to be like me, okay? You don't have to be like me. Because see, me, if I want to eat that motherfucker, it's up. And it's Ate stuck. the fuck up. When that shit up, it's stuck. Listen. But you ain't got to be like me. You can wait till you find somebody that you into. See, that's how I used to be. I, like, if you ain't my bitch, ooh. It took me twenty years. <laughs> to eat it. Man, shit happens. It yeah, took me twenty years. Either. My first really piece of pussy took me twenty years. Well, I don't even remember the first time I had my first lick of coochie, bro. This nigga was I, in I grade school, remember. like bitch. I, I wasn't in grade school. I licked that motherfucker. But, I, I, I'm but, I'm almost, but I'm almost for sure I was I in think. middle school. It's hard once they once they set the bar at licking ass. Yeah, like, like I don't think I've done anything. You know what I'm probably should have went last, but it's the way shit happens sometimes. They know. They know. I don't know. It's like I don't know. Stuck my finger in my own butt. That's fucking that lit. Is lit. That's lit. That's lit. That's fucking. I wish I could. That is lit. I respect you. <laughs> I mean, uh, you should never be disrespected oh, in the community. That is the sexiest God. shit in the While fucking world. While I was getting world. hit from the back. You should never <laughs> be disrespected <laughs> in the community. Give me some. You should never be disrespected in the community. She said, exactly. I stuck my own finger in my butt. That's so funny. And I you was getting him, hit from the back. And then oh. I asked him if he liked that. Oh. You like I'm that? Not, I'm not really. Yeah. I'm Nigga, what you say? I was like, nut buttons. Nut buttons. Uh, oh. it, felt, it felt more good yeah. than I did. I mean, I'm pretty sure it did hit. Huh. That was. Huh. I'm not okay, sure well, because I don't. Because I can't yeah. think of anything. Yeah, come on now. Yeah, I mean, what's the nastiest shit you ever you did? You ain't never licked no Gucci before? Lick a gu- okay. <laughs> I'm licking whatever you ask me to lick. I'm oh. Lick. Don't ask. Oh. I'm nasty. I'm nasty. <laughs> you don't say. You yeah. are sick, baby. What I'm you mean? Licking, I promise. Whatever oh, you lick. Fucking I'm, God, I'm that was nasty. funny. So once I'm once I'm in the once we in this room and we got that plan down, what? I whatever the this over here belongs to you. So whatever the fuck Period. you ask me to you do, don't say. I'm doing it on my mother. I'm doing dead it. Dead homies. Like say dead homies. Dead homies, baby. Whatever you ask. Let's go to break house. <laughs> Come on, y'all. Let's go to break house. Can, can we, can Episode we thirteen. Popular ignorance. I'm D Lo A one six. That's D Lo money. That's my thing, baby. <laughs> That's motherfucking Kumia. Hey, baby, I'm here. Wait, wait. Okay. I'm fucking brick house. You say you're going to lick what? <laughs> spizzle. I'm going to take my spizzle. Y'all are nasty. Y'all is nasty. They was being nasty. Always. Welcome, Bree, back, y'all. Hey, we, y'all. We ain't here with the pinstripes. <laughs> with, with, the, with the stripes today. You know, we had to we had to look good for y'all. Look at this nigga d <laughs> Look at this nigga d Welcome, 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 and welcome again to Brick House. Where the, you know, the nicer version of d and d Maybe not as clean, but, but we're still here. We are still here. We are still here. 
you know, we make it sound better. Even if we don't agree, we still make it we still make it sound sound better than um, you know, than they do. So let's get into some of these topics. Actually, let me pull. Give me a second. Give me a second. <laughs> all right, all right. Matter of fact. I missed y'all. <laughs> oh, this question. Mm, 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 mm. <laughs> How do you ask a man what y'all are without scaring him away? How do you ask a man what y'all are without scaring him away? You don't. No, <laughs> Um, you really you don't because ask it not ask you can ask you can ask if the if y'all situation has potential to move on to the thing but if you give him the power to determine what y'all are without you really putting no input in it then that's all y'all are gonna be what the goal is yeah if you ask him like in the long term do you see my do you see me being with you in the in the long term you know right he'd be like yeah right now i feel like we cool da, da, da. that's how you get into that conversation who has gonna give you a, a, you know, a exact plan. I'm an gonna, exact plan i'm gonna ask exactly and that's what, from from then on <laughs> from then on <laughs> i'm gonna ask what we doing beforehand because if i feel like you wasting my time I, I'm gonna say, but I, I won't say beforehand, not immediately when I meet you, because maybe when I meet you, I might just, you know, I no, might think it, you cool, but no. I don't want to fuck with you on that level. Yeah, not immediately. Like after a little while, I'm gonna ask you, what's what's going on? What are we doing? Should you ask after y'all have sex or before? Before. before. You're before. not getting another cookie. Nah, you might get some of the cookie, but. I'm going to ask you. <laughs> Not ask you, but I'm gonna be like, so uh, are we going to start talking or is this where this ends? You know, just let me know so I can. I'm, I'm going to ask him. I'm like, do, do you want to just have sex or is exactly. it going anywhere? Exactly. Just let me know. So. Exactly. We can fuck and it just be fucking. That's cool. Niggas will tell you after you fuck them. Niggas literally, I mean, it can go either way, but niggas will tell you after you already fuck them if they want to fuck with you just so they can keep getting pussy. Yeah. Also, after they get it the first time, Right, exactly. Yeah, I'm weak as fuck. So I would do it before, just cause like, hey, if you really, if you really trying to be something with me, you gon', if you ain't trying to be fuck with me, fuck with me, I'm not giving you the pussy. Like, niggas will, niggas will tell you that shit. Like, they might still be sick and watching your so, ass. But that's the thing, niggas have to. No, I'm not saying niggas. People in general have to be <laughs> honest. If people would stop lying about how they feel or stop withholding that information of about how they feel it would be so much easier and so much better for relationships and the way they go if motherfuckers was honest about their feelings about the situation if you don't see nothing going nowhere with that boy or that girl tell her um mm, i see that this is going to become an error if this is going to continue to be an issue we can't be together or, you know, I see that we are very different on many things. I don't ever see us being together. You can be honest with people. The way they take it, you cannot control that. But your effort in being honest, you can control everything that you say. So, be mature. Be grown. Be an adult. Y'all fucking. Be an adult. <laughs> say that, please. They won't go. I feel like things go much smoother if y'all from the jump speak, like, tell what y'all coming for. Like, I'm trying to be in a relationship. I'm trying to fuck. If you Simple. Just trying to, you, know, you know what I'm saying? Like, if you tell them from the jump, like, hey, this is this is what it is. Like, mm -hmm. it goes much easier. And if you catch feelings, you know for a fact, like, well, he said he just wanted to fuck. Like, exactly. You can't really be mad at can't, him. Exactly. You can only be mad at yourself yeah. for continuing to deal with something or, or wanting it to change. Exactly. You, that's that's something, ladies. 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 Listen, I'm gonna talk to you slick too. If these niggas, if these niggas are telling y'all that they don't want relationships, you cannot convince him. You. It does not matter. He, he will treat you good, and if he's telling you that's not what I want, 
out of this situation. Stop. Just because he's treating you good does not. That he's not gonna treat you like. Uh, he's not gonna treat you bad because he does like you. He just don't want to be with you. And if you don't want that, stop. Go find somebody who wants to be with you. Go find somebody who wants to be in a relationship. Because if you're steady trying to make a person who doesn't want to be in a relationship be in a relationship with you, just because you like how y'all rock and just because you because they're treating you good. Then I want to be with you. Simple. He Niggas do, do what they with want. No remorse because he's single and he told you from the jump. He told you. That's what's gonna come out of his mouth when you say something. To I him. told. I, so you said if he's single, he's gonna do whatever he like, wanna do. Not, not he's going to, but like if a nigga like if he's telling you, if I don't. He's telling you he don't want to be in a relationship. Mm -hmm. And then you catch feelings, and he's still saying he don't want to be in a relationship. I, that's not his problem. Like, okay, well I'm trying to make it exclusive until like he's gonna feel like he has the right to, to do because he he, he did let you know. You catch feelings in the case, like in the. I'm not Right. It would be best for you to, to stop die yourself back, and right? Stop the sexual con contact. If or you whatever. Like you catching feelings for him and he done told you and he ain't changed his mind about being in a relationship, you should probably stop fucking him because he's probably going to say. I don't know why she looked like that. Who was that? Darian? What did I say? Davion? Davion Ross Stewart. Yeah. Why are you looking at her like she don't want to be there? Because she don't like none of y'all, matter of fact. And I'm just playing. I'm <laughs> just playing. She do. She fucked with y'all heavy. She fuck with y'all heavy. She do want to be here. She just I just have my business face on. That's she's all. Hungry. Her, no, yeah, she's, she's not herself when she's hungry. I got one more on here, and we're going to hop off this live. So here goes this quote, or this little post. It says, I'm a loyal friend. I'm just not a friend chaser. Once I get a vibe of being unwanted, I leave folks to the, to the ones they think so highly of. Felt. Yeah. I do that. That's... That's my thought process now. I, I am, and I, I get so, but I do this too often. That's that's my issue. Is that I feel like if I feel a weird vibe, at all, you're okay. done. You're done. If you blink like you don't want to fuck with me, we done. If you don't want to be my friend, just say that. Don't fuck with me no more. Period. I won't call you no more. Oh God, I be feeling, I be feeling some type of way because I be feeling like motherfuckers be trying to do me so scandalous. Motherfucker, Kivana said, Brie. Um, motherfuckers be trying to be be doing me scaleless on a sneak. So like, if I feel some weird shit, I'm like, nah, bro. I just know you, you acting funny. Oh <laughs> God. I take that My thing is this: the minute I start getting that weird vibe of you, bad energy or what, mm -hmm. whatever you want to call it, I can't be around you. I you can't. Start, you starting to. Yeah, because you're starting to affect my energy and the way that I'm yes. acting. And yes. it's, it's going to start the... Because spirits you. jump. They do. Spirits that is jump. Facts. If, you, if you happy one minute and you're around somebody that's negative and then they leave and then you find yourself all... In a like negative up, mood. Yeah, it's because spirits Stay jump. Stay away from them motherfuckers. Have, that's why they tell you... That's why they... Bitch, what's your attitude? That's, that's you should have gone. That's why they say all the time, like, be around people, be around positive people. Like, or at least people who promote the same type of energy that you do. Yeah, like, say if, say if you're an entrepreneur, mm -hmm. you need to be in a, you need to be a, a group of people who are supportive, who are entrepreneurs, or who has that business, like, uh, mindset. And if you're not around them and you're around people who don't want to apply themselves, then you're going to find yourself, well, maybe this not isn't wanting for to me. Apply yourself. You're going to start second-guessing yourself, and then you're going to start feeling like, okay, yeah. Because when people are in a hole and they don't have nothing going for themselves, they're going to try to drag you down no with them. And if you notice, True. If, if you notice, there's a lot of people that you'll see on Facebook who are successful, and then it's somebody who don't have as much as them, but they want to make you feel bad for being right all up on your shit, yeah, talking shit, talking about you ain't got but this. But it's like you applied and yourself, you bragging, yeah, like, no, I'm just bragging yeah, myself. I'm exactly. They say you bragging. They say you bragging, but they're not going to expose what you went through to get exactly. to that point. Right. So at the end of the yeah, day, the minute, oh God, they're not going to talk about, oh, yeah. about none of some that people shit. People struggle to get where they go, but at the end of the day, that's not their business for you to explain to them. At the end of the day, if somebody's energy off and you don't feel like it's necessary for you to be around that person, then they need to go. There's no if, no if, ands, or buts, or maybes about it. If it's consistency, negative energy. Yeah. Yeah. And. You need to know. It's okay. People have their days. Everybody has those days. 
every if time every time I, I talk, if every time I call you or talk to you, you have a problem. Somebody said, "Be around people who don't judge you for being yourself and don't have to change to be liked." At the end of the day, exactly. if you gotta change who you are, your identity for somebody else, and they not they're they're not supposed to be a part of your life. Period. True. A real friend or a real significant other or whatever Depends the case on may the be. Personality traits. They gonna bring out the real you. You gonna feel your most. You gonna feel your most self and the, your most comfortable is yep. being around somebody that is true, the person that's supposed to be with you. Somebody true. that is, you'll know when you're around that right person or that right friend when you notice that you're smiling more than often, exactly. you're happy more than often, you exactly. are excelling in a different level than you are because you can start off down Watch here the and you around. Keep. Yeah, and definitely. And if you're around somebody that is successful, not even so much as successful, but breathe positivity on you and push you forward to that new height that you need to be on keep that person around that's the person you need because sometimes we don't do that push we'd be too scared but you're gonna have that you're gonna have that friend that's gonna step Fair. and until you get that friend that's gonna step you're gonna find yourself in that same in a lot of situations that you don't need to be in. exactly so just be careful of those and be and some some friendships i will say are worth like worth the fight because there was a point in time where my friend Jory, I'll tell this little tidbit. My friend Jory, shout out to you. Like we had a not a falling out, but like we had a, had a time where a disagreement. Yeah, and I just was too involved within my relationship and not you know having enough time for my friends. And instead of just leaving me and not not you know allowing our friendship to grow, she kind of chased after me and had that conversation with me. So I'm not saying never chase your friends or relationships that mean. A lot to you. It's it's not really chasing. It's just worth worth the fight. So you know, just let them know how you feel about the situation. And if that person is really your friend, they will make the effort to change. So I'm not saying just give up on any of your friends where you feel a weird vibe, any of that. But you know, when you know that y'all had a good relationship and there was a bump in the road or something that changed that, then you know, work to fix that problem. Don't don't so easily give up. And I think. A lot of times, us women are able to forgive our male, our, our boyfriends and shit, but we're not as easy to forgive our friends. And sometimes our friends aren't as easy to say, I'm sorry, as our men are. So you just got to take yourself out of a situation for a second and just figure out who, you know, who's genuinely there for you and who's not. This and then is, just move. We get to the point where y'all need to recognize who really in your corner or not. I Facts. mean, y'all, I think y'all are pretty much are at that age where y'all you know, should, where y'all know. And the reason why I say that is pay attention to the way people move. You got to be very observant and you need to be very protect, Let me protective of you your nigga. spirit, That's your, weird. your energy. Because not everybody is meant to be around you. Not everybody is meant to be your friend. Not everybody that comes in your life meant to stay in your life. Some people are there for a season. So if you find this person, the yes, if you keep constantly going through negative situation, finding yourself in bad, horrible situation, you need to control all, delete that person. They're not, they're not supposed to be a part delete. of your life. Control so at, so at the end of the day, you got to, again, even if you got to rock it by yourself, <laughs> stake you leg it by yourself, then do okay. with anything that's that's necessary. Because at the end of the day, when God take you out of here, you going by yourself. This These monies, these bags, ain't nothing coming with you. It's just you, boo. Just you. So just you. at the end of the day, like I said before. Find who, if somebody, find who suits you. If in like uh, going on to what she was saying, when her friend chased her, I've been in that same situation. Sometimes when you are in front of other people's faces, you're not paying. You, somebody's in your face, you're not paying attention to the stuff that they're doing because mm -hmm. you are very much involved with this person. So you find yourself single, or not even single, but you're on the outside looking in, right? And you see the very situation that you went through in another person's eyes, but from a different standpoint you're able to you'd be like okay i see what this person was saying and all this other stuff they wasn't crazy they yeah. weren't jealous they weren't being negative they were really my friend trying to look out because you got some friends like girl so you don't gotta worry watch out that. for your good friends because people tell you to watch out for you know snakes and stuff but watch out for the people who really care about you so that they can so you can allow them to care about you and have them friends that it's hard have them friends that make you take accountability for your actions facts because if they don't and you just out here wowing Next thing you know, you end up out here. On some you know, bullshit. Yeah, or worse. Or, <laughs> yeah, or worse. 
and you and that friend know that they were supposed to intervene and be like, hey, man, you need to chill out. You're doing too much and all this other stuff. Us here, y'all might see us bickering and arguing and stuff. Mm-hmm. But at the end of the day, when we give, when this camera is off, we gonna create. We, we gotta gonna, correct each we other. We gonna correct each other at the end of the day because we're a family. So like I said, you have to have the right people around you, Thanks. and you gotta make sure you have the right people rocking with you. Because if you don't trust me and believe, it's gonna show. It's gonna show. A real friend gonna let you know what's exactly. up. Exactly. It ain't. They ain't gonna let you keep going out here doing whatever Please. and whatever. And if y'all friends is musty, tell them. Because I don't want to smell her. <laughs> if I put you, if I got you stink, you need to let her know. Especially if she rode with you, because y'all rode with the and windows you, up. And, and I know you, you smell knew, that. and you knew before she hopped in that car, she needed to freshen up. A real friend, for is real. Gonna, a real friend is gonna tell they they friend the truth. Like, hand your bitch. friend a paper period. towel, bitch. I don't know what to do. <laughs> you period. Better, please, period. Tell y'all friends they is musty, cause I would hate to be the one, cause she gonna want to fight me. She might want to fight you too, but y'all can handle that on y'all own time. Y'all know where each other live and all that. I don't have fight. time. I'm, at the, I'm not about to fight somebody because they Tell your friend she musty. musty. Tell your friend her clothes <laughs> is ugly. <laughs> Tell your friend she need to take that sew in down. Be a real friend. Tell your friend her Be a real friend to that. That's for sure. And tell your friend to stop trying to force her baby hair into them struggle ponytails because she pulling that baby hair out. Yes. So, so stop that. So at the end of the day, we grown. Y'all need we to grow. grow. Y'all too y'all too old. Y'all too old and grown to be lying to folks. If they stink, be tell real. Them they stink. If they, they stink. If they yeah. if they if you feel like they moving shady or moving you know crazy, tell them. Dang, we had two hours, man. So yeah. <laughs> Man, Period. this was another episode of Popular Ignorance. What was it? Episode 12? Yeah. And this is Brick House, and we are here every I think it's other week. 13? I think it's episode 13. 13. I keep saying 12. <laughs> episode 13. And this is the second episode of Brick House. There's more to come. We're here every other week. So y'all just keep a lookout for us because we always going to be here. This is Popular Ignorance, and we are. Out of our daddy. All right, I'm going to fuck with you. <laughs> <laughs> Y'all good.